stop Gaku Pop. Yeah, we're good. I really hope it doesn't drop again. It seems like we're a lot steadier now, though. Yeah, we are Gucci. Make sure you guys refresh the stream so you're not like uh, five years behind with stream lag. But welcome everybody to the stream. Sorry, I'm still checking on the side. I'll just have my quality meter up uh, on the side to make sure we're good. I just want to play video games. I just want to play Persona 2. Please, please just let me play this video game. <clears throat> yeah, no, the chat box doesn't work. Streamlabs is giving me a hard time as well. I don't know why. Well, Streamlabs sucks anyway, but like... <laughs> oh, wait, none of my alerts are working. Where's that? Oh, oh, wait, what's going on? Wait, is something going on? Wait, no, that's working for me. Wait, where are my alerts? Don't do this to me, bitch. No. I want my alerts. At least I'm here. Hi, everybody. Welcome to the stream today. Ugh, this borked stream. It's not supposed to be borked. Um, I can refresh the cache. Let me see what that does. Hi, everybody. Technically, the stream is fine, though. We're not dropping any frames. The stream itself is running smooth. It's just alerts and stuff now. And chat. Chat's not on the screen. So, yeah, I have no idea. It was working, though. <clears throat> Your scarf is cute. Thank you. It's me embodying... I'm not gonna lie. I'm a, I'm a big Zelda fan, and... I'm just, like, really anticipating Breath of the Wild 2. Oh, I cannot wait to play that game. Hi, everybody! I hope that the alerts work eventually. I don't want to, like, restart the stream again. Maybe they'll just work eventually? I'm gonna keep refreshing the cache to make sure or to see. Um, I wonder if I'm logged out. Is that a thing? Let me see. No, 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 I'm not logged out. Like, my chat is showing up here, but it, it should show up on the screen, too. <clears throat> hello, Nahabino. Thank you for saying hello to Nahabino. That's very nice of you. Oh, I want the alerts to go off. Let me do a test through... Okay. Sorry, technical difficulties. I was actually excited to... I don't know if you guys saw Sega News this morning. I wanted to talk about it. I was all excited about it. <clears throat> My full metal index. Thank you. I wear this literally every day. Every day for the past... I was a junior in high school whenever I started wearing it. Or a sophomore in high school. Junior. I was a junior in high school. So I've been wearing this since 2011. 11 years. I've been wearing this necklace. <clears> then <throat> wanting more money? No, no, no. I mean, like... No, I think it's actually good news. Well, besides Sega CEO being weird. But, like, in general, it's good news. So, like, Sega announced their, like, fiscal reports this morning. And it was actually, like, really cool to see how much SMT and Persona has been selling over the past years. Since its inception. Um... Yeah, they said that they sold, like, 15.5 million copies of Persona since it started. Like, since Persona 1. That's how many copies of all the games that they've sold. And literally 46% of that, 7.7 .7 million, is Persona 5 alone. That is... bonkers. The fact that, like, half of it is Persona 5. Which is... I mean, understandable, because Persona 5 is, like, the introduction for a lot of people in the franchise. But, like, just seeing the numbers is like, whoa. 
and to make it worse, to make it worse, uh, sorry, to make it better. So with Persona 5's release, 77% of those 7.7 .7 million copies sold, 77, that's a lot of sevens, but 77% of it is Western buyers, which is amazing. So I think it makes sense as to why starting last year, they started pushing ports because they actually are acknowledging their Western audience now. <laughs> they're like, oh shit, we've been selling so much in the West now. And now they're like actually paying attention. And this goes, see, this is where it's like weird because like they've been selling so good and like honestly really good, like great shit Atlas They're They saw the numbers. See, like this is the best thing that you can ask for. A company looking at their data, seeing that their Western audience is massive and them actually catering to Western audiences more and more. I mean, it's a new thing for them. I feel like people, I'm, I'm like, honestly, I'm sorry. I'm really tired of the Persona community in general that that like everyone is so demanding. Like, why didn't we get any, any, get any Western attention for the, for the 25th anniversary? Like, I'm so sick of all the whining. I'm sorry. People are bitching left and right. Um, but like, they are so not used to it. Like, th they've only started adjusting to Western fans in the past year. Like, it's just been one year for them. People cannot give them a break. Like, they're just not used to this. So I got to give them props that they actually, like, are noticing it. And now they're going to start doing everything as, like, a worldwide release and... Um, world, uh, yeah, world, world, worldwide releases... And what was the second thing? There's a second category in there. Doesn't matter. But like, that's a big deal that they're actually like going to do that from now on. And RGG is the same with the Like a Dragon series. So it's really cool that like RGG and Atlas know that the Western audiences are really important. Worldwide releases are really important. So they're prioritizing that from now on. And like, honestly, good for them that's that's amazing like i'm really happy to hear that and it makes me really excited about the future like things uh, events that they're gonna start doing more in the west you know <clears throat> so yeah so thank you to the the western response of these games they're actually paying attention now to us which is amazing we just gotta keep being like positive influence and not whiny bitches, but everybody do be a whiny bitch this past year and I'm gonna sound like I'm so fucking tired of it. <clears throat> it's it's a new thing for them. The fact that I was actually impressed, they, they set up like an entire cafe in LA or something. I was actually surprised that they did that. I thought it was really cute. But the thing is, so Atlas and RGG are seeing how important it is to reach out to Western audiences and Sega, the Sega CEO, is the is the true boomer. They still don't see the benefit of worldwide releases, which is crazy. So the studios underneath Sega realize this, but Sega itself does not. <laughs> that, that boggles my mind. <clears throat> at least, at the very least, the studios that are underneath Sega realize it. That's the important part. At least Atlas and RGG are actually better than Sega right now. <clears throat> it's really weird. So the CEO of Sega is just, I didn't realize how like problematic he is. He's just like super boomer. Oh, I, I actually never really looked at him before. So <laughs> yikes. Now I don't really want to. <laughs> I'm playing Persona 5 Royal for the first time, thanks to you. I saw you yeah. and I love your P5 Strikers gameplay. Yeah, Sega Amazing. seems like the like the major Sparkles. kicker in the company. I think more people are blaming Atlas for this shit, but Atlas is, I think, is actually doing a fantastic job really trying to push in the West and seeing the importance and then Sega's the one pushing them back. 
basically what I'm saying is, uh, don't be a whiny bitch. They're trying. <laughs> and I do greatly appreciate that. I, I like whenever you see data and you're like, oh, I must change my ways. That's very hard for a company to do, especially the bigger you are. So like, you gotta give credit where credit is due. Um, thank you so much for the 100 bits. I really appreciate it, Spooky. <clears throat> Hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Atlas is doing very well listening to feedback. Like, if anything, I cannot give them enough props <laughs> for just listening so well lately. I feel like I've seen it a lot, especially in the past year, just how much they've been listening. And also more Western appearances, like them appearing at uh, TwitchCon and then like this weekend at MCM London, uh, London Comic Con, like, they're there, their booth, booth is massive. They never used to do shit like that, though. Like, like, they're doing so much better with marketing in the West. Like, props to them. <clears throat> yeah, right? The fact that they're in Europe right now, like, it's, it's, it's crazy. Like, I'm very, very proud of them. So, like, seeing the data, the numbers this morning was, like, really nice and welcoming to see. I really hope that people lighten up a little bit and are less are less harsh on Atlas, uh, because yeah, they, I mean, an RGG too, like a Dragon series, like they've they're pushing, they're 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 really like paying attention to the Western audiences. The fact that I even got to interview the director, uh, like here uh, Sakamoto-san, like the fact that I even got to interview him at all was like a huge step for them. He's never been to the West before. And he took the time to go out himself to interact with the Western audiences. Like, that is such a massive step. Massive. He's never been here before. I just, like, I can only be so happy about that. And I can only just respect it so much. I hope I, uh, I'm so jealous about MCM, by the way. I hope everybody that goes this weekend has a good time. I really, I really just, I want to go. <laughs> I saw pictures of like the, the Sega Atlas booth and I was like, oh, oh, I wish I was there, man. Mm. Uh. Hmm. <clears throat> Oh, Loud and Annoying? Oh, wait, Loud and Annoying is at MCM2? I didn't know that. Give it time, give it time. I think Atlas, I think, <laughs> I really think Atlas has a lot on their plates right now in terms of how much shit they've been doing lately. Um, not even just like, I know Soul Hackers like wasn't the best for them, but the fact that it was like a B team, it wasn't their main thing. I still think it was good for them. And so they were making that game, creating, they're working on all the ports for P5 through P3P. They're working on Persona 3 Remake in the background. And Persona 6 is also being worked on. I think that they have a lot on their plate right now. And they're still not the biggest team in the world. Um, I think they, they do have a lot on their plate right now. So like, they'll get, I think they will start getting to the other stuff whether it's like porting old SMT, like I, I, I'm very confident in that happening, especially with how much they're listening lately to the community. Um, but yeah, give it, give it time, give it time. Also, wait, did that alert work earlier? The 100 bits? I don't think it did, fuck. Wait, maybe it did, did it? Fuck. <laughs> Hold on, I'm still trying to fix that while chatting, but at least the stream is good. It did go off. Okay, cool. So our alerts are working. It's just the chat box that isn't working. Cool. As long as we're getting somewhere. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I do think that ports will happen of older games, especially. They're seeing the importance right now. And they are listening to the community, so like, I do think in the future, I would dare say near future, they're gonna acknowledge Persona 1 and 2. I feel like there will be an acknowledgement. 
if the 25th anniversary said anything to them. Like, they, they hear the people, they see the people, they see the requests. It'll happen eventually. Like, if the past year has spoken anything about Atlas is that they're paying attention and they are trying their best. They're under, aren't they under a new director too? So like, it seems like the direction the past year has been amazing. <clears throat> yeah, ports don't happen overnight either. The fact that they've been working on the P5R and P4 Gold and P3P ports, like that has probably taken this entire year for them to do. That alone. Like that's that's a that's a lot. And that that would mean that they basically saw the fiscal year in 2021 and immediately started working on it after getting those reports about the western audience. That would mean that back then that they saw that and immediately started working on it. Like they, that, there was barely any hesitation there, which is only like, when you look at the, the timeline of events, that's a really good step, the fact that they moved that fast. Like, that's actually pretty crazy. Cause that was, they got this fiscal report, like the numbers I sp spout out to you, they sold 15.5 million Persona copies in... That came from up to June 2021. So that even hasn't counted the past year and a half-ish. Now imagine the sales after all these ports. That's what I want to know. Like, woo! The sales after these ports is probably going to be insane. Hmm. <laughs> <clears throat> Sheesh. I do think P5R will hit 10 million, yeah. 7.7 .7 million copies sold off of just PS4. That ain't a small fucking number, dude. That's crazy. <sighs> anyway, so I'm just testing my alert box. Uh, Erwin, if you're still here, thank you so much for the 12 months. I'm sorry the alert went bonkers. Uh, let me see if I can actually get it up on the screen now. It's actually not showing for me entirely. Well, that's fucked up. <clears throat> I've actually not looked at the Steam stats for Persona 5 Royal. Oh god, wait, 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 now I'm curious. I haven't looked at it at all on Steam. Let me see, let me see this. Load faster. What's wrong with you? <clears throat> P5R on Switch has been sold out in most places. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Oh my god. Okay, my uh, my computer is dying. It's moving like a fucking ant right now. It's so slow. Are ants slow? I don't know if that was a good analogy or not. I can't see it on Steam! It's not working! <laughs> fucking hell. Hmm. <clears throat> Five hundred K already. That's insane. Okay, like I, I actually can't. I don't know what is wrong with Steam. Anything I click is not actually going and moving. What is happening? Is my computer being this slow? What is going on? I think my computer is dying. Like, it actually is not functioning. Holy shit, this is so bad. Anyway. <clears throat> oh, don't even get me started with Neo. Oh, that's so unfortunate. <clears throat> If it's dying, how are you streaming? There's this thing called priority. I, 
I run my stream on, uh, what is it called? Authority, uh, makes it, my stream, it processes this first and foremost. Stream, and then the other performances on my computer don't go as high. It's barely showing this. It seems like it's going really good though. It's so weird seeing P5R on Steam. It finally loaded it. But anyway, so generally, I'm really happy. Um, it's important to put things into perspective instead of whining on the internet all the time. Like, Atlas is listening. In general, like, I think RGG and Atlas are really, really good right now at paying attention to Western audiences and especially feedback. Uh, but yeah, there is a huge difference between kindly requesting a port of an old game and being an asshole about it. <laughs> like, there are humans behind the community manager team and they are very overwhelmed. <laughs> they've been trying their very hardest and they've been killing it the past year. So, yeah. I'm just really tired of seeing a bunch of whiny bitches online. <laughs> oh, I guess that's just my rant, dude. It's just been so tiring being on the internet the past year, just seeing people constantly complain about things they shouldn't be complaining about. Oh, God. <sighs> yeah. Like, I, I mean, I get the feeling, too. It's like when people request me to play a game, there's a difference between, like, uh, why aren't you playing this fucking game yet? Like, why aren't you playing the other Ace Attorney games yet? I'm waiting. There's a difference between a comment like that and being like, can you play Ace Attorney? I really love this game and I would love to watch you play it. There is such a difference between those two requests. One, on one hand, it makes me not want to play the game. On the other hand, I'm like, oh, I really want to play this game because that person was really cute. <laughs> like, it's the same deal with this kind of behavior toward game companies. Exact same behavior. <laughs> I hate that shit so much. <clears throat> I get it so much. It's it's sad that I get more rude comments about requests for playing games than nice ones. <sighs> I'll keep trying to be more vocal about it and then maybe I'll make a difference on the internet. Um, even if it's like a very small dent, I will, I will be proud. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah, the P5 port whining was pretty bad. I think I just felt more bad for the community managers. Like, I'm always thinking about the workers because now I know a few of them in person and uh, I've met them. And I just feel so bad the amount of toxic shit that they have to deal with with people being so rude. Like, completely unnecessarily rude. Oh, I'm like, how do you deal with that? I really couldn't. I can't, I can barely deal with that as a content creator. I can't even imagine being a community manager for like a big company because then people treat you like a, you're a company and not like you're a person like it's a there's a big there's a big difference there so they get a lot of shit <clears throat> especially when they know they're working on it but they can't reveal it yet right imagine that <laughs> people requesting the port for the past year and then the community manager just has to sit there and read it like, we're working on it, oh my god, one day they'll shut up. <laughs> uh. Uh. Anyway. <laughs> That's my rant of the day. Just be kind on the internet because uh, humans are humans. They're just like you and they have feelings and it's important to, you know, not forget about that. I'm very proud of RGG and Atlas, not so much Sega lately, but I'm very proud of them. They've been, they've been killing it. I love seeing them pay attention to Western audiences. I'm excited that they're at freaking MCM, which I don't know if they've ever been in Europe before. Another huge step for them. Like, I only see good moves in the past year, and I'm very excited about that, and it makes me very excited about the future. So quit your bitching, okay? 
Hmm. Oh yeah, they did have a Soul Hackers 2 event in London. Yeah, because my friend uh, Calcera was the uh, cosplayer for Ringo. She did amazing. It was really cool seeing her have that gig. But yeah, I did see that because of her, actually. Her cosplay was so good. I'm glad that she got that paid opportunity. Hmm. <clears throat> Hmm. Yeah. Eh. Hold on. Oh no. I lost my monitor. Okay, we're back. Anyway, that's my rant of the morning. I think I'm ready to play Persona 2 now. I got that out of the way. Whew. I gotta see the adventures of Mr. Uh, Tatsia here. Giga Chad Tatsia. Some people hate him, some people love him. This town's a little bit weird. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Okay, sorry, I'm getting stuff set up on my end. Here we go. Aww. I have no idea how to say your name. Rax, Raxisid? That's very sweet, thank you. <clears throat> All right, here we go. Gaming. Gaming, 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 gaming. I forgot. I know I was supposed to go to Seven Sisters High. I guess I'll find out when I get here. All right, back to school. Woo! Hey, yeah? I wonder what's up. Did something happen? You could say that. The big clock in, in the tower suddenly started moving. Not the big cock in the tower started moving. It said clock. Crystal. <gasps> the golden butterfly. What does it mean? Oh, is that guy like gonna wet himself? Is he okay? What's the matter? Why all this fuss over his clock starting? There's tons of scary rumors about this tower, like ghosts appearing and other bad stuff when the clock starts again. Oh no, what a terrible omen. Namu Amida Butsu, Namu Amida Butsu. Take it easy, Gramps. There's no need to be scared. As long as I'm around, you got nothing to worry about. No, something awful will happen. Before he died, that teacher said the world will end if time is not stopped. Are you talking about that teacher who died in the clock tower? Yes, that's right. That teacher nobly sacrificed his life to save the children and ensure world peace. No, this can't be. The seven Pleiades uh, set the frozen time free? Has it begun? The Naru the Naru Roto the Naru Rato stone. What about the Naru Rato stone? Okay, Miss Ideal is all about that. I was kind 
into Miss Ideal. Can this day get any crazier? The big clock started again, so I'd say yes. Can we really prevent the curse by taking the emblems off the our uniforms? That girl got a portrait. Oh god, your face! The curse! It's the emblem curse! Oh god. Dude, what? Did that girl's face just... What's going on? Does this mean it isn't enough to take the emblems off our uniforms? Let's hurry and find Principal Hanya. We need to lift the curse before my face and Tatsia's gets all messed up. <laughs> I only care about my face and Tatsia's. Aikichi, yeah, his face can go to shit, man. I don't care about that guy. But me and Tatsia's face, we can't look like that! Everybody else, fuck them. The statue is gone. Oh, okay. <laughs> Oh, nice. Ah! Uh! Okay. It's moving. Yep. It's moving. So, that settles it. <laughs> hey, Quev. Yeah, uh, Buffy is always, like, protecting the stream. Protector of the stream back here. <laughs> I just put it up for Halloween. <laughs> It'll be down November 1st. I think so. <laughs> Hell no! That's impossible! How could something that ridic this ridiculous actually happen? My 3,000 yen! Oh, I should probably take off. Yeah, I don't know how to fix Twitch chat. Maybe it'll just like randomly work later in the stream. I have no idea, man. I'm sorry, chat. It's like we heard. Rumors are coming true. Woohoo! I'm 3,000 yen richer now. Let's go get some dinner, Tatsya. Uh -oh. Are we dating or are we dating? <laughs> All right, all right, I admit it. Rumors are coming true. Damn it. I think that stubborn Andy boss finally got gets what's going on. I'm glad I made that bet with him on the way here. Oh my god, that's all she cares about. C could the Naruto statue stone be affecting this statue? This is terrible. Kashihara, what should I do? Hmm. What are you kids doing here? You must leave at once. Why? Look at the statue! It's walking around! Don't you think that's dangerous? Uh, it's the statue of the principal that's rumored to walk around. Seeing it polished to such a sheen grates on your nerves. Oh god, it looked at me. Can we... Don't look at me. Let's just leave. I think leaving is a good idea. Oh, oh! I didn't think you would actually let me! Oh, fucking hell! I can just leave! <laughs> I was like, oh, surely the game's gonna stop me, and it just didn't.
Okay. Just leave. Oh my god! I can just full on fucking leave! This is amazing. <laughs> I guess I should head back. Didn't know there was a Twitch. Well, welcome to the Twitch stream, Ben. Welcome. I guess I should go back to the school. <laughs> It let me leave, by the way. I'm gonna make it face this way. Oh, the fact that it moves. Oh, God. Ugh. Someone who put that in the Discord? Uh, like, Tatsuya's expression is the same exact as Buffy's. It's literally the same thing. Like, these two things are the same. <laughs> it's great. <laughs> they are the same picture, I swear. You two are bros now! Oh god, I'm bros with the undie boss. Sounds like the rumors about your exploits are true. What? What the hell? If you want my emblem, come and get it yourself! You just want other people to solve your problems. Senpai, take that guy's cuss high emblem. If you give it if you give it to us, it should protect us from the curse. You don't want to get get us sick either, do you? It's not like hell it's not like he'll give it to us if we ask nicely. Come on, you're strong, just do it. I like him so- oh god. It's not like whining and begging will keep the curse away. What a dick. <laughs> Buffsy, uh, no! <laughs> Don't do that to Tatsia, man. Hey, Tatsia? Was it really the best idea to bring this guy along? It's honestly... I'm honestly getting worried now. You see that, Tatsuya? That babe over there is giving me a come-hither look. All right, time to draw my love gun. Come here, my little kitty cat. Want a real rock star to write you a love song? Oh, God. Isn't the boss of Cuss High? Is he here to start a fight? And that cocky look on his face. Oh, Senpai, I feel faint! Have you seen Chikarin? Damn it, I bet she's wolfing down burgers at Peace Diner again. What? Apparently that guy really did get an operation. I keep hearing these weird clanking noises from him. I bet he got implants from some secret organization. I knew it! Good thing I told everyone about my theory. Oh! Your theories are nothing in comparison to mine! Now I'm cursed and my golden arm is making weird noises. My dream of being in the startup lineup has been granted, too. The big leagues and the groupies are all still only a dream now. <laughs> I just did. Oh, my God. My heart, man. <laughs> Holy shit, I just, I did not expect that. A human, I wanna talk to you. Why don't you say anything? Is this the first time you've talked to a demon? Yes. Ugh. 
Are you nervous? You don't have to be. I know, I'll teach you how to make contact with demons. Wow, this slime is so nice. So, do you want to learn? Sure. Squishy squash. Okay, I'll teach you. You know what demons are? Sure. You're thinking, they're scary. Scary monsters, right? Well, that's not true at all. Bloop. <laughs> demons are just like you, Screech. You humans get happy, angry, scared, eager. Those emotions are what create demons. So we're the same as you, Gloop. Demons get happy, angry, scared, and eager too. I'm sure you want to be friends with us. Bloop. Do you need to, so you need to try to keep us from being angry. We show our emotions through our words, sounds, and actions, and a gauge. Bloop. Squishy, squish. Take a look! Boing. This is happiness. It's the green gauge. When this is full, we'll be willing to make a pact with you. You get good things when you have packs with us. You can get tarot cards you can't normally get or hear interesting stories. Bloop. But we're not going to give them away for free. Even if we have a pact, you need to talk with us again. Bloop. Mush, mush. This is anger. It's the red gauge. See? Mush. If this gauge fills up, we end the conversation. We'll be so upset, we won't talk with you again. We might even end up and attack you. Bloop. If you have a pact, we'll end it right there and then. So nothing good happens when you make us too angry. Got it. Split. This is fear. It's the blue gauge, see? If this fills up, we run away. Squishy squish. This is eagerness. It's the yellow gauge, an exclamation mark. There's a point to filling this one up. If you, Have you been to the velvet room to get your personas yet? Squish. To get a new persona from the Velvet Room, you need tarot cards, and you have to get them from us. Bloop. In order to get tarot cards, you have to fill up our eagerness gauge. Um, thank you so much, Blue, for the three months. I appreciate it. Mm, the stronger the persona, the more tarot cards it'll require to summon. Squeeze. Boing. So if you want a strong persona, you have to talk to us a lot. Blue. Also, the other emotions, happiness, anger, fear, they can go up along with eagerness. Squish. For example, boing, this is happiness and eagerness going up at the same time. The green gauge and the exclamation point, see? Sure, yeah. If both of these are full, you can't form a pact. Instead, something else happens. Feeling eagerness at the same time as anger and fear will also have different results. These four emotions will normally fill up in three stages. Bloop. My advice is to try to focus on just one emotion. Next, let me talk about the demon personalities. There are many types of demons. Bloop. I'm sure it's the same with humans. As smart guys, short-tempered guys, timid guys, they all have different likes and dislikes. Figure them out while you're contacting them. There are eight main types of personalities. Wise, foolish, joyful, gloomy, forceful, timid, snappish, and haughty. All demons have between one and three of these distinct personality types. This is so much. They'll have different reactions to the various ways you try to contact them, but you won't know a demon's personality until you make contact with it once. That's about it. Squeeze. Now, give it a try. Do impressions, persuade, discuss manliness. Death stare. Okay, if I was role-playing as Tatsia, I would discuss manliness. Tatsia spoke in detail about what it means to be a man. Blue. You're all talk. Oh god, I made him mad. So it's like this, get it? Blue. Sometimes demons will ask you questions in response to your contacts. Uh, they'll even start talking to you right when you meet them. When you figure it out, once you've contacted demons a few times. Wow, that was a lot of reading. Bloop. Thanks for paying attention. As a reward, I'll give you three tower cards. Squishy squish. Good luck to you. That was a very nice slime. Very kind demon. What a freaking homie. Lisa's Cantonese lesson number two. Why is used like, hey, when you're calling to someone. When you double it and say, why, why, it acts more like, hello? Remember that. Okay. 
What do you want? The committee meeting's over, so I'm allowed to go home. I can leave without disobeying the principal. You won't catch me getting cursed. I've had enough of this, but I'll still be here again tomorrow. Ugh. So, he feels fine as long as he's safe. Looks like all the guys at Sevens are lame asses. You can't say that, buddy. Friendship with Tutorial Pixie is over. Slime is my new BFF now. Oh, God. Oh, God. Is that actually... Oh, my God. Okay. Make contact with the enemy. No. I'm just gonna beat one up and see what happens. I just started this game and I'm already asleep. We have water damage. Wow, you literally just get thrown into this fucking battle system. Okay. Select who will make contact. I'm asleep, so let's try Lisa. Okay, this is gonna take a bit. Okay, um, maybe we dance. Dance with it. How are you all doing? Time for a dance lesson from Lisa. Here we go. Sorry, Nightmare will think about it. I'm sorry. That's a lie! Nightmare's mad. Why'd you have to go and make Nightmare mad? Because I hate you. Oh, and full on angry. Good. I think our first interaction went really well. Oh my god, what is that? Wait, what? Okay. I literally, Lisa can do nothing. Oh, good morning, Tatsia! Dude, this is the first battle I've ever had. Why am I getting so many status effects? Okay, now we have to see if our SP restores after each battle. Probably not. But I have to see how this game works. Oh my god. Oh my god. Rank 2? Basic attacks, they block basic attacks. Oh, 
earth damage. They float. Earth damage is not going to do anything. Oh my god, Tatsu. Never mind. Earth damage worked. Why is this so ridiculous? Oh! I now can use straight slash. I know that you block my attacks. I just don't want to spend my SP. Oh, there we go. Holy crap. What just happened? Whoa, what? Oh, I get to distribute points? Oh, oh, oh yeah, baby, let's go. Okay, so my SP is fully back, but I think it's because I leveled up. That would make the most sense. It's a courtyard. Oh, the healing is all the way over there. I probably should get over there. Talk to it. Okay, poltergeist. They're like a playful one. So maybe if I do impressions. Katya did an impression of construction equipment. <laughs> Excuse me? jump scared by this game than we did with Phasmophobia, though, bro. Oh, God. <laughs> That's not funny. Kids don't care about that stuff. Grown-ups are always like that. They don't understand our feelings. They forgot their own childhoods. I sold mine at a yard sale! <laughs> ah! Something tells me you're making fun of me! Oh my god, I'm so bad at this! Oh no! <laughs> Tatsia tried forceful persuasion! He, he looks so mad right now! I don't get it. Tell me again, but do better. Oh my god. I'm gonna try impressions again. Does it do something different? Close your eyes. Uh. <laughs> Bro, what are you doing? Tatsia! These impressions suck! <laughs> you made him mad! Why are you trying to mimic a motorcycle engine? <laughs> Why? Why would you do that? You idiot! <laughs> this fucking dude! Why would he go room room? 
die. Oh my god, poltergeist! Oh god. Oh god. Oh slimes! They they are my best friends. Don't worry guys, we got this. I can easily contact a slime. Alright, alright, alright. We're gonna try these impressions again. Did an impression of a fighter jet. Uh, why? <laughs> Boring! Okay, fine. Discuss manliness. Spoke in detail about what it means to be a man. You're all talk. Oh. Uh, do I even have blood? Do I, wait, do I even have blood? You probably don't. Do you have proof? You're not just saying that, are you? Uh -oh. <laughs> I think I need to quit playing. <laughs> I thought if I could be friends with any demon, it would be a slime. They were so nice to me before. What happened? Is there like a um, auto? Let's see what auto does. Yeah, there we go. Make it go by a little bit faster. Uh, oh, I also have this handy dandy button. I forgot. Oh, this is where emulators are great. <laughs> <laughs> All right, poltergeist, I'm back, bitch. All right, let's do this. This time, Michelle, it's up to you. Ahem, don't fuck up. Self promotion? What? I've got to see this. How beautiful I am. I'm so gorgeous. It's a sin. That's right. An affront to man and God. Oh, Father, please forgive me. Help, pervert! <laughs> Does he say it again? Okay. I didn't know if it was the same thing again. Um, okay, discuss life. Oh, maybe, maybe sing. Sing sounds like a good option. Okay. Okay, this is a gift of love from me to you. Take it, sweetheart. Oh, I'm scared. Okay. Okay. I think that went well. Oh, Jesus Christ. What are these things? Ghosts? Zaffin. <clears throat> Why is he holding a trident? I think auto battle is going very well. 
Yeah! Three more points, baby! Let's go! Oh, wait, no luck. Strength build, strength build, strength build. <laughs> Whew, okay, let's go upstairs. Talk. It's a me. Oh, God. Um, you know what? Auto battle again. I'm I'm god game. Wait! Wait, that wait, that went too fast. I wasn't expecting that. Oh no! I'm poisoned! Fuck! That went terrible! Senpai, you can't go in there right now. They're having an emergency meeting about the disease. A little late for that, huh? I wanted to ask my teacher about the curse, but they won't let me in. They're having some kind of conference. Oh, God. It's like 2 HP every fucking, like, three steps. Oh, God. Let me just save my game before I just die. Maybe it'll just go off on its own eventually. <clears throat> Only one way to find out what shit does. Oh! Contact. Pixie. I want a pixie. Uh, Lisa, I feel like... I have no idea. You, Lisa, you you try. Just Lisa. Discuss love to Pixie. Even if you can't see him, you can't forget him. That's true love. What? Oh! Wait! I got happiness! Let's try that again. Pixie likes talking about this stuff. Yo, Pog. Okay, let's let's keep let's keep taking this. I know I should be working on eager. Do you remember your first love? I remember mine. After all, I'm still I still love Tatsuya. Humans are funny. I want to be your friend, but Pixie can't just run off with you. So I'll make a pact. Will you make a pact with Pixie? Yes. I've got a friend in Pixie. We're, we're, we're learning how this game works. Don't worry. I'm still poisoned. Now that I think about it, you can call ghost... Uh, you could call ghost stories rumors in a way. Then could this be... I saw her. It was really Hanako. I've always heard rumors, but they're true! Why won't anyone believe me? Please, Senpai, defeat Hanako and bring back proof she really exists, and I'll make sure to reward you with a little something. Oh? Oh, I gotta remember to come back to Class 2B. That guy cracks me up. Uh, get this. He says he saw Hanako in the bathroom. Come on, we're not grade schoolers anymore. Is that the boss of Cus High? He looks dumb enough to fit the bill. Don't stick close to him, or, or his stupidity will, stupidity will rub off on you. Noriko, I wonder what happened to today's club meeting. I can't go home until it's over, but I haven't heard from any of them yet. I want to hurry and pick up the search for sister. She hasn't given up on her dream yet. She needs those shoes. Priorities. Priorities. Hey, did you hear what that dude said? Come on, Hanako? In this day and age? Wait, with demons popping up all over, why would I be surprised if she's real? I gotta get with the program before it bites me in the ass. <clears throat> okay, uh, what, what? I, I wanted to save. Usually, poison only takes you to 1 HP, but I'm just making sure, like, what if... 
This game is retro enough. Maybe, you know, they did a lot of cruel shit back in the day. One HP, it, it, poison could actually kill me. Who am I? I don't fucking know. I will never underestimate an old game. Our editor who went to it go investigate the links between the Emblem Curse and Cuss High isn't back yet. Miyabi Hanakoji was the school's paper editor, now that I think about it. Don't worry, I'm sure she's somewhere dozing off again. Hey! Did you just say Miyabi Hanakoji? You know Hanakoji-san? Tell me! Miyabi Hakata Hanakoji is a student here. She said she was heading to Cuz High. Did you see her there? No, just some fatty called Cozy. Wow, so Hanakoji-san said goes to sevens. Wow. What, you saw Cozy? Don't you know Cozy is... Stop! Hey, 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 Undy Boss. I know Miyabi really well. What was your relationship with her? What? So you know her too? Hanakoji-san isn't a raging bull like you. She's a slim, beautiful, classy lady. Isn't she? Slim? Beautiful? Hold it in. Keep it together. So, uh, how do you know her? Uh, our relationship, uh, well, she's my ex-girlfriend. Uh, we were dating in grade school. We broke up eventually, but I still can't forget her face when she cried and said, Ikichi kun I can't bear to be apart. Oh. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> His grade school crush, huh? Putting aside whether I believe that at all, he hasn't figured out yet that Cozy is Hanakoji-san. No wonder Miyabi told me to keep quiet. <laughs> this should be interesting. Let's not say anything, Tatsuya. <clears throat> wow, so Hanakoji-san is at sevens. Just... Wow. Oh my god. I never knew our editor and the undie boss used to be lovers. How strange fate can be. This is a huge scoop. How interesting. But why exactly did they break up in the first place? I'm dying to know. Oh yeah, Shiba and Miho were looking for you, uh, Lisa. Did you- did they say where they were going? I guess they got a phone call and both rushed out together. Oh god! Didn't mean. Lisa-san, when have we have our school festival, Miss Seven will definitely b b be you! Miss Seven is decided by b b beauty brains and raw strength, and you speak K Cantonese and English! You're, you're p perfect! Yeah! I'm almost dead. There's nothing down there. Up we go! There we go, am I dead yet? All right, just be friends with the slime and everything will be fine. Okay, um, Michelle, it's all up to you. Um, they... take control. <laughs> Yo, you think demons are the shit? As long as I'm alive, you'll never have it your way, biatch. <laughs> Are you a big city guy? So, what's a big city guy? Uh, it's a guy who lives in the city. <laughs> yeah. Uh. I guess I'll just be literal. You're 
then are your parents cities too? I don't see how that works. Let's try that again. <laughs> yo, 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 listen up, punk. This party's under Michelle's control. You got a problem with that? Then bring it. I feel good. <laughs> Hasn't the weather been weird lately? Is something gonna happen soon? Is the world ending? Sweet. That's not true. You're worrying too much. <sighs> yes. Do you have proof you're not just saying that, are you? I had to do it. This is so silly. Hey, Say it yo. to me, chef. Oh. Hey, yo, what's this noise? You got something to say? Say it to me, Shell. I'm really interested in humans. I'll give you three tower cards. Okay. I did it. One HP gaming. Let's go. Did I go in here? No. I really keep thinking the poison will eventually go off, by the way. I'm just about to do this whole game at 1 HP, bro. Look, I play all RPGs the same. I'm an item hoarder, and you never see me using an item. I ain't about to just start this game and use an antidote in my first 10 minutes. Like, bruh? No, I gotta hoard that shit. Getting cozy, I see. Ha ha ha. Exactly, I might need it later, thank you. I might need the antidote later at a more important time in life. Sorry, I'm transitioning. <laughs> we're going... We're, we're couch gamers today. Ugh. That's as low as my desk goes. I'll just zoom in my camera a little bit. Nah, I don't need to. There we go. Oh, wait, I just got comfortable. I should have put Count Bino here. <clears throat> exactly, final boss. I think I should save my 100 elixirs. You get me, you get me. All right, let's go. It's Friday, it's couch comfy day. That's what we do here. Let's go, buddy. All right. Hey, Tatsuya-kun, what's gonna happen to Sevens? I'm scared. Hey, Tatsuya-kun, I was looking into legends of this school and found an interesting story for you. Remember the serial arson case from 10 years ago? A lot of people died, but they never did catch the culprit. Rumor has it that the culprit might have actually been a student here a student named Tatsuya Sudo. <laughs> I wonder if he's connected to this curse somehow. What? So you've had trouble because of your dad. Well, you know, let's not get it. Let's not let it get either of us down, right? You know what I heard? Your dad shook down the Yakuza and got booted from the police. Talk about a shady guy. What's that guy's problem? Don't let him get to you, Tatsuya. It's just a rumor. Yeah, the guy's name that totally isn't my name, but like super similar, but totally not my name. But it's it's not me, guys. It's it's not it's not me. Oh my god, my camera. I'm so sorry. What happened? Are we good? Are we good? Eh. eh? 
Okay, we're good now. Ugh. It, it's not the same name, obviously. I'm gonna save again because I'm probably gonna die. We're gonna find out what happens when you die. I'm expecting things I'm expecting. Um, if the protagonist dies, it's probably an automatic game over, but we don't know yet. We're gonna find out real fast, aren't we? So I'm probably gonna die. Fucking poison. This bitch! All right, um, Michelle, it's your turn. Let's sing to Nightmare. Hey, darling, escucha mi canción de amor. He actually, he's singing in Spanish. Oh my god. He's fluent in Spanish? You're into it, mister. But why are you singing by yourself? Don't you have any friends? Plenty, don't worry, baby! I know it's a lie. Oh god. I know the rest of the sentence says uh, cancion. I'm assuming cancion means song. Listen to my song of love. I think that's what it's saying. I, my Spanish has escaped me since, like, I took six years of Spanish. And I don't remember all the words, but I think, I know escuchan means to listen, escuchar. But cancion, I'm assuming, means song. Okay, song, song of love, okay. Oh yeah, Nightmare wants to know about school. Can Nightmare go to school with you? Eh, you're a demon. That's so mean! Suck it up, bitch! You think Nightmare's stupid? Nightmare isn't stupid. I know. Oh my god, it's either I'm lying or I like, if I tell the truth, it's too harsh on- Like, I, there, there's no winning. Oh, wait, fuck. Um... Brain of streamer empty. Yes, sometimes. Sometimes I do you like that game. Die, bitch. Oh, zero. See, poison damage does zero. Why am I so worried about it? Let's try this again. The singing seemed to. Oh God, no! Wait, what? What? Let's go, everybody. There's combo moves. So long. Oh shit! Maybe I should auto battle more often. Game just taught me some shit. Gain two ranks. Mutation is a type of persona growth that happens sometimes after fusion spells. The better your capability, the likelier they are. Okay. How the persona grows depends on its rank. The higher its rank at the time of mutation, the likelier, likelier of a rare or useful mutation. Um, some can become a different persona entirely by selecting mutation in the velvet room. A few personas can only be obtained this way. Shit. Okay, that's a interesting mechanic. So they did the slash of the earth together. Interesting. 
check that classroom and then this room. I thought that... Did I miss the teacher's lounge? Oh, they were blocking the teacher's lounge. That's right. Serves that Yoko right. There's no way she could be as pretty as Junko Kuru Kurosu. I hear Junko Kurosu is a Sevens graduate. She was a big deal about 10 years ago before disappearing, but she's making a comeback now. Why me? I wasn't ta- I won't take this lying down. Not ever. I, I was supposed to get back at you too. I'll become Miss Sevens if it kills me. And I'll use it as a springboard into showbiz like the first Miss Sevens, Junko Kurosu. Okay. Yoko's a pain, but that girl Lisa can be pretty distant too. Does she think that we're not worthy of her because we're Japanese? Hey, Tatsuya, where were you? These reporters from Coolest were here a moment ago. I bet they're still looking for you. There were two of them, and they were both hot. Man, how come you can get how come you get all the hot chicks? When my face isn't messed up like this, I'm actually pretty good looking too. <laughs> I'm sorry, bro. Whoa, wait a sec. There's people from Coolest here too to interview you? What? Why not me? How could they write a story without interviewing the handsomest, m most beautiful guy around? I'm sorry, Michelle. Huh? What are you talking about? Tatsuya deserves it because he is the coolest. Who'd you want to- who'd want to read about an undie boss like you? <laughs> Lisa, okay, honey. Sheesh! Saving my gay man frequently because I'm basically about to die any second. Can't forget class 2B. <gasps> oh! Is that a cat girl? Ratatosker. If what? Squirrel girl. But what? All right, it's all about uh Michelle. All right, let's uh, uh let's uh let's take control. Maybe 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 they're into that. Yo yo yo, listen up punk. This party's under Michelle's control. You got a problem with that then bring it. I don't want to be your friend. Oh. All right, baby. This song's for you. Hit it. Gas Chamber of Love. You're cool. Let's do it again. <laughs> nice. Play with me again sometime. Here's eight hermit cards. Eight? Holy, that's a, the eight cards? That seems like a lot. So these are fusion spells. Oh, I can set them. Okay, interesting. Oh. So many. Oh god. Cheese. Okay, figuring this stuff out. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, wow. Look at that luck, though. My luck stat is through the roof, guys. Poison will go away once we level up. Sorry. Ah, fuck. Didn't happen yet. I'm gonna actually test it out and see if I if I level, it'll actually take the poison away rather than using it item. <laughs> oh god, I'm an idiot. <laughs> Woo! Principal's office. We're supposed to find Principal Hanya. Looks like the principal's not here. Hey, you! Have you seen the principal? Tatia is perma poisoned by toxic masculinity. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, no, we've searched everywhere and he's nowhere to be found. Where do you go with the school in such chaos? Uh, I was so sure Principal Hanya would be able to handle this cursed stuff, too. The Great Michelle comes all the way to Sevens and its own principal isn't here. Ugh, that great, the great rock and roll swindle. Are you a student from Kus? I mean, Kasug Kasugiyama High? Okay, time to introduce to one and all the headlining act Yours truly, mi This guy's got cuss high emblems on him. Oh, God. Oh, that's so cute! His eyes! <laughs> Goddamn cursed creeps. What's with this school? What did I do to deserve this? Crazy! Thank you so much for the tier one stuff. I appreciate it. I hope you enjoy the emotes. Serves you right for coming to Sevens with a Cuss High Emblem on. What? Okay, back up! This whole thing happened because of you summoned that Joker. So take some responsibility and do something about this! <laughs> now you've crossed the line, Buster. How was I supposed to know at the time what would happen? And what's with all your big talk? You're just an undie boss who pervs on, who pervs on people by yanking their pants down. Undie boss! Undie boss! That's rich coming from you. You are a freaking white girl, but you talk Japanese when you're not spouting nonsense words. Do you even know what country you're from? Maybe I should give you a name you can understand easier. You're Ginkgo from now on. Ginkgo, Ginkgo, Ginkgo. Vanna, no you don't. You're not saddling me with a lame nickname like that. Dude, dang. They just went so fucking hard on each other. Oh, now what What do we have here? Chow, wait a sec. Things seem to be getting steamy here. Come on, kids. Not everyone wants to get caught in the lover's quill. Aichi and Ginkgo. Oh, no. They even put it. They even put Ginkgo here. Oh, no. How is this a lover's quarrel? Wait, who are you? Oh, no. Oh, I... I hit the speed button. At times I'm an ambitious reporter, other times I'm a mild-mannered editor. But my true identity is a rising star of Coolest Magazine's editorial staff, Maya Amano. Nice to meet you. Maya Amano, a beautiful and cheerful journalist. She's gathering rumors from students to compile into a special report. 
Oh, this is Yukino that they've been talking about too. Me, I'm Yukino Maizumi. I'm a freelance ph ph photographer, an apprentice one anyway. Maya's partner and apprentice shooter. She does part-time work to pay her way through photography school. Yukino Mayuzumi. My Mayuzumi. Really? Great. Here, babe. Take my picture for the cover of the. Ugh. <laughs> no. Why is Lisa's name Ginkgo? I hate this. Turn it back. Coolest? That's been that's been popular lately, huh? What's one of its staffers doing wandering around a like high school? Okay. We came here to do interviews for a special report we're working on, called the Rumors of High Schoolers. The emblem curse here at Sevens is the best one known one after the Joker game, you know. But it's been chaos since just after we got here. No one's been willing to give us an interview. What's going on here? Can you tell us what you know? Is it related to what we came uh, to what we came to interview people about? Um, about that, we don't really know anything, right, Tatsuya? Hmm. Not sure I buy that. True stories, babes. We're not looking for Seven's principal, and we certainly never got stomped by any Joker. Stomped. So you kids do know something. If you're trying to cover it up, I take it that it's a pretty big scoop. In which case, we're definitely not letting you go. Hurry up and fess up or I'll make you regret it. Oh! Found you! Joker's orders! You kids! Kill, kill, kill! Oh my god, people just coming in here whipping the knives out. Oh my god, I'm still at 1 HP! Yukino! Maya, protect me! Maybe they're healers. Look out, you gotta stay back, ladies. What was that for? School violence is so passe, I'll have you know. My son, these guys aren't human anymore. They're demons. You have to run. How do you guys know about demons? Uh, d demons? But but if I run, I'll handle this. So get going. Let's see. It's been a while, but here goes. What do you mean it's been a while? I'm just gonna whip out a person. My guardian angel, come to me. I am Maya. The workings of the Pleiades shining in heaven shall be yours. Wait. Bearer of the full moon. Her name is Maya, and she has a persona named Maya. <laughs> what? <laughs> they really just had to make it the same as name. All right. Sounds good. Okay. Persona! I am Vesta. In your destiny to accompany your true love and lead the lost ones, I shall protect you with my flame. I like how, um... Lisa and Aikichi are both like on their knees and Tatsuya's the one standing and Tatsuya's the one at 1 HP. everyone okay? Whoa, what's wrong? Were you that scared? Huh? Why am I crying? It's so strange, but I can't stop. It's 
like a nice memory. Warmer than what I felt when Tatsuya and Ginko like a hug from my mom. How weird. I felt it too. What was that wave of nostalgia? Could you elaborate? I know more than you'd think about demons. Maybe I could help you kids out a bit. same powers I do? Persona, huh? So it's not just my guardian angel. And wow, I can't believe you're a Persona user too, Yuki. I've been a Persona user since I played the Persona game back in high school. It is our... What you look not... You look nothing alike! I'm staring at a picture of her right now. What happened? I don't see any sort of resemblance at all. The fucking hell? There's no way. That is actually so funny because like, what was, what was my complaint about Persona 1? I mentioned that in reading it, the two people that I felt like were the most useless in the plot that could have been just ripped out are Ayase and Yukino because they made like no impression on the plot whatsoever. And it's funny, they were like, oh, she didn't get any real screen time in Persona 1. <laughs> Let's put her in Persona 2. Okay, so that is her. Interesting. I thought I was going crazy. <clears throat> that does not look like her. I don't see any of the facial features at all. Okay. Anyway, so yeah, same Yukino. That's crazy. Um, have you guys never played it? Persona game? I played a kid's game like that in a dream once, but... A dream? Lisa, right? Know anything about this? No, nothing. I've never played any game like that. Well, we can save your origin stories for later. Let's focus on where we go from here. Jaime, seriously? You're gonna come along with us? You three are chasing Joker himself, right? If we, ca if we could catch him, that would be one hell of a scoop. Plus, if we go with you, maybe I can find out how, how I became a Persona user too. It's just like Persona 1. Everybody has a Persona. <laughs> Everybody has a Persona. Nobody's special. I'll tag along. Now that I know this guy's in cahoots with demons, I can't sit back and do nothing. Hold on a sec. Our only lead is Principal Hanya, and he's not here. There's nothing for us to do, even if you came along. Then let's start by putting an end to this madness. If the Principal is behind the chaos like you think he is, won't that draw him out of hiding? But Maya-san, how are we supposed to deal with this? Do you have a plan? I know. Let's destroy all of the emblems in the school. Getting rid of the cause of the problem should help, right? If rumors are true, coming... Uh, if rumors are coming true, the curse will be lifted once the emblems are gone. But could that really be happening? 
I think positive, guys. Even if it doesn't work out in the end, we have to at least give it a shot. If I remember right, Seven Emblems is based on the Pallides, yeah? Then that design must show up somewhere else besides the emblems on the uniforms. Let's look for it. Like... The clocks in the classrooms? Like, their faces have the same design on our emblem. Okay, friends. And enemies of modern music. Our fleeting youth is going to wait while we stand around. Let's hurry up and find those emblems. Isn't going to, whatever. I'm still at 1 HP, by the way. Oh, and I can't save. Well, fuck you. Oh. <laughs> God damn it. There, I saved my game. You can't stop me, bitch. <clears throat> I get this weird nostalgic feeling from her. That's impossible. We've never even met before. The memories evoked by the Lady Maya-san. They were warm, sad, and painful. All at once, like the ringing of my heart. You felt it too, right, Katya? And yet this is our first meeting. Is that love that's destined to be? We were actually looking for you earlier. I mean, there's no way we'd leave without interviewing the famous Tatsuya-kun. Stare. <laughs> Put that aside, Tatsuya-kun. Have we met somewhere before? <laughs> nah, just kidding. That, uh, like, that even be possible. You're just a fine-looking guy that I had to get a good old oogle on. Oogle in. Oh my god. <laughs> well, this is a surprise. I never knew there were other Persona users besides us. By which I mean my old pals. You've heard of it, right? The Sebek scandal three years ago. Mikagicho got completely walled off. It's a long story, but that's when I woke to my Persona. There was me and eight other guys. My pals and me threw down with demons and other Persona users and took back our town. The news called it an accident, but that wasn't at it at all. Sebek's Kandori. <laughs> Never mind. Water under the bridge. Kandori's dead, bitch! And so is Maki. Just kidding. Maki's not dead. She lived! Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, yeah! Wait a second, Tatsuya. Could I bother you two? Fine, Mrs. for a second. I've got a special present for you as our new allies. This is so cute. Can I really have one? Look, Yuki, they're a matching set. You want me to use a pink gun? Oh, oh no, not pink. Sorry, but I'm already carrying my favorite weapon. Oh, so cool, Yuki! Hey, check out my sweet skills! Sheesh! This, uh, oh. I thought that they would have other dialogue. Can I save now? Fuck. Can I save now? Hey! That was a big cutscene. We just met two people. Yukino's back from Persona 1. Tatsuya's still dead. Oh, we got people to talk to. All right, let's go. Oh, never mind. I can still do this. Honestly. All right, Maya, just jumping on in there. You can shoot your gun from far away. 
but she chose to jump right in front of the enemy and shoot her gun. Okay. I'm already sick, so I'm not scared of the curse. I'm just helping out because I like smashing stuff. Oh. Jeez, some people are just taking advantage of the situation and wreaking havoc for kicks. Wish they followed your example, Tatsuya. I'm not dead yet! Who's next? You're all doing great. One day I'll get to level four, and then I'll be able to fully experiment if I actually can uh, uh, get rid of the poison this way. This would be a lousy way to end our high school careers. Let's not let that happen. We're good here, so go check somewhere else. I'm still not dead. Oh my god, I'm still not dead. All the emblems here are destroyed. W would you mind checking the other classrooms, Tatsuya? Let's smash the emblems and the curse. Oh, that's right. That's what I'm supposed to be doing. human will you talk with me please oh hey there's something i've always wanted to ask a human hey are video games fun i've never played one don't lie to me you're playing one right now Oh. <laughs> what makes you grown up so special, sex appeal? Something tells me you're making fun of me. I'm not happy. My chest, it burns. What's wrong with me? That's the feeling of love. Did I finally die? I finally died. Oh my god. Wait! Oh, the game isn't over when I die. Oh, I thought it was going to be game over, bro. It's not game over. I thought this whole time protagonist dies and I die. Oh, I just don't get any experience. That sucks. Let's see if I at least come back from the grave, though. Am I at one HP? I'm at one. Oh, that's an exploit. Just die. You come back, you're at one HP, but my poison's gone. Oh, this game is easy. Yeah. Cripes. Lisa's been pretty harsh. I don't blame her for being upset at someone who talks to her like that, but... What are you talking about? I don't need Joker to whip you in a beauty contest. It was your personality that got you rejected by Tatsuya anyway. Honestly, everyone's like you at this school. I hope they all get cursed. Woo! <laughs> oh, Ginko's all mad now. One girl's vault is another man's lesson. Shut your face, undie bastard! Yeesh, she's scary. She's not really one to talk when it comes to girls' personalities. Yo, I want to get cursed? Wait, aren't you supposed to be at a convention? Max Poetic. It makes no sense. How is that brat Lisa not cursed? This isn't fair. Of course she's the reason for this curse. She asked Joker to do this because she was jealous of me. Tomorrow? Oh, okay. I'm, I'm, I'm massively jealous you're going, by the way. I keep seeing pictures of it, and I just really want to go. 
Kyoko's a pain, but that girl Lisa could be pretty distant too. Did she oh wait, yeah, we read that guy. You were selling Call of Duty to Englishmen? Oh god. I'm sorry for your loss. That kind of does sound miserable though. I don't think- yeah, I've never been here. Okay. It's locked. Not the rooftop! Oh god. Oh, wait, Call of Duty was released today? I don't pay attention to that game at all. Yo, I'm alive. I don't think you guys want to watch me play COD. Who needs a potion? Just level up. It's simple. Just level up, plums. That's all you need. Did you hurt your arm, Maya-san? Oh, you were just feeling dizzy. It looked like you were rubbing your right arm is all. A serial arson case? No, I'm okay. I just feel lightheaded for a moment. Chippy. Oh my god, Mac. So we started over there. Okay, so now we're going back down. this disease. Whoever's behind this better watch himself. Curse or no curse. We'll root out the cause of it. Are you destroying the emblems too? Well, thanks. This classroom's taken care of, so go check the others. Oh, my! Oh, we got more people to talk. Let's try Maya. Uh, discuss parents? Oh, let's compliment them. You're incredible. I really admire that. I don't want to be your friend. Oh. Um. Interview? People just can't get enough of you, Nightmare. Got anything to say to your fans? I'm embarrassed. Consult. Hey, now. It's not healthy to bottle up your emotions. If you've got a problem, Sister Maya here, here will listen. Oh. But Nightmare can't go with you. Why can't Nightmare go with you? Okay. What? Ikichi's ex-girlfriend goes to sevens? Whoa, Ikichi, I underestimated you. Woo, you sly dog. <laughs> wow, so Ikichi's ex goes here. Wait, this is no time to tease him about it. We have to break the emblems, remember? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we gotta break the emblems. I forgot about that. I need to go back to the other rooms. Oops. Uh, I forgot the point. Well, 
at least we weren't like all the way down at the first floor. Oh, oops, that was down. So this room. Okay. Thank you, Tansia Kuhn. That should be all the emblems in this classroom. Could you check the other ones too? If I feel like it. Human! Radish Oscar's never met one before. Yippee, Skippy! Radish Oscar has a question. Why is the sky blue? An angel spilled blue paint. Honestly, I don't fucking know, dude. Why can't you tell Radish Oscar I hate you? Not talking to you anymore. If you say you're sorry, Radish Oscar will think about it. Sorry. Every time I try to give a genuine answer, they're always like, no, it's a lie. Every time I cannot win against these freaking demons. Whatever. Oops. I keep pressing wrong buttons. Okay. I think, uh, okay. Destroy the other classrooms. Okay. I love this form of battling. It's great. Thank God for fast forward, am I right? Hanako, huh? She's a tough nut to crack. She's resistant to fire and physical attacks. Oh! That's good to know. Let's go to the Kuzunoha Detective Agency and have them spread the rumor. Oh, I forgot that was a thing. Come on, Hanako, in this day and age? Uh, I remember the rumors about Hanako of the toilets from whenever I was a kid. If she really exists, then that'd be a scoop. Why is Maya just see- like, she seems so into all of this. Why? You're concerning me, child. Going there. imagination. It's gotta be. Whoa, hold on there. That's not why we came to interview students. We were just here to investigate Joker and the Emblem Curse. 
I don't like getting the stink eye just because I'm a journalist. I'm not here to hurt anyone with my articles. That Maya san chick, she's got her hooks into me for some reason. Could this be the start of a burning love? Oh yeah. Are you going to help us destroy the emblems? The ones here are already dealt with. We've already destroyed all the emblems here. Where else would they be? Oh god. This game is easy. Look at- I'm the only one that does damage. Oh, why would I never play this game? I always knew I was gonna play it. Just a matter of when. But welcome to the stream. Where's that Hanya hiding? He has to be in the school somewhere. He's probably in the faculty room or teacher, yeah, teacher's lounge. Love is the great misunderstanding, huh? I wonder if that's true. Ikichi-kun is so funny. Well, they say that love is a great misunderstanding after all. Maybe this is how it happened. There. Hmm? What am I doing, you ask? I'm sending a smoldering gaze at the babe over there. Look at her. Her face is all red now. She's under my spell. Oh my god. He's so naive. It goes past being funny to just plain sad. I wonder if he's been like that ever since he was little. Damn. Oh, teacher's lounge. Now they mention the teacher's lounge. All right, let's just go straight there. You want some? We're so strong. Oh, Maya level up. We got a revival bead? I should probably save. This might be a boss fight. Enough! Stop letting random rumors push you around. Honestly, what a headache. Oh, this is cute because in P1, Yukino loved Miss Saiko so much. Oh, Miss Saiko, what are you? Yukino? It really is you, Yukino. I transferred here last year, but never mind me. What are you doing here? Don't tell me you're redoing high school. <laughs> oh no, I'm on an assignment. I have a part-time job as an assistant photographer, so I came to cover a story. Ah, yeah, Miss Saiko and Yukino-san know each other? She was a student of mine at my last school. Your timing is in, a, in coming here wasn't very good, I'm afraid. As you can see, we're in a bit of a crisis. Yeah, uh, about that. There's something I need 
need to tell you. A rumor caused all of this? Then the curse will lift when the emblems are gone. In that case, I'll help too. Tatsuya, I take full responsibility here. You have my blessing to go and destroy all of the emblems. Is this really going to work, Chinya? You think Maya-san's right and the curse will be lifted once the emblems are gone? We're finally on the last emblem. We need to hurry and find Mr. Hanya. Come on, Tatsuya. Time for the big finish. These emblems here are the last of them. I hope the curse gets lifted after this. Oh, really? The curse will be lifted if we destroy the emblems? The students will be cured? Then go ahead and destroy them. What? I'm a little busy here. I need to destroy those emblems and quick. Get my face back to normal. It's tough finding every emblem. Not even I could predict where they'll all be. It's just like we said, we should have destroyed those emblems a long time ago. All right, Tatsuki, go crush him. So the curse will be lifted. Uh, Miss Sayaka, wait, sorry. Hope you're having a good morning. Love for you put in a key five stream with a speed gender. Um, thank you so much for the thousand bits. I appreciate it. Thank you. Although it was you, Narakami himself. It wasn't me. I appreciate it, though. Oh, hey, where are you going, Tatsuya? Isn't the last emblem here? You should hurry and destroy it. Did I not just destroy it? There's another one. Okay. And there's one. They have three of them in here? Jesus Christ. There we go. Okay, my lovelies. That should be the last one. That means everyone should get... get, get uh, should get better. <laughs> that was a good dummy on that timing. Thank you so much, Lucky Squid, for the pre for the, the prime sub appreciated. Thank you. I hope you enjoy the emotes. Hmm. I really thought that they'd get rid of the curse. Did we overlook something? Oh man, I think we're forgetting the biggest one. The enormous clock in the clock tower. It's still there. Oh my god, the music. Holy shit. Ahem! Attention all students! You will immediately cease all destructive activity within the school grounds. As principal, everyone must obey my orders. Do you hear me? You will treat my seven sisters high with respect. No. I suppose we have no choice but the if the principal says so. Come on, everyone. The, humble the emblem hunt is over. Let's start cleaning up. Uh. What? Damn, Hanya. But if everyone likes this, there's not much we can do. Anyway, don't we have a big clock to go break? Wait a sec, Chinyan. Isn't the clock tower always locked? I say we find the key first. It's probably in the teacher's lounge somewhere. Let's try asking the teachers about it. Why would you go there? If you have time, you should be cleaning. We must obey the principal. It really makes me mad for some reason, but that bald but I mean, <laughs> you like Principal Hanya too, right, Tatsuya? You need the key to the tower? Someone seems to have taken it, so I can't lend it to you right now. And since Lisa's with you, your grades in English are horrible. Tell her she needs to take it more seriously. Key to the clock tower, I see. So you're going to handle clean up there. Ah, the principal took the key that was here in the lounge. The janitor should have the, uh, the other one. 
The janitor, all right. So the janitor room. I think that was on the first floor. Oops. Ah, the camera flipping is fucking me up, man. Stop flipping my camera! I thought that was outside. I guess I should just see the doctor. Oh no, this is... Okay, this is it. Hello! Excuse us. We'd like to borrow the key to the clock tower. Key? Hi! The key to the clock tower! You have it, right, Grandpa? Clock tower key. Where did I put it? All right, Gramps, breathe deep and try to remember where me with me where you put it. Who knows what this guy will remember? It'd be faster to look ourselves. Nothing in the cabinet. No key here, but plenty of side dishes. Whatever she says, that lady seems to be taking good care of Gramps. Whoa! This dresser is full to bursting with cutouts and glossies of that actress Sayuri Yoshikawa. Yeah, yeah. What's up, Tatsuya? Gramps and I are having a man-to-man -man chat here. Stick your nose someplace else. So musty! Jeez, have these futons been aired out this decade? I don't see any key here. Ugh! I don't see it anywhere! Oh man, then what should we do? By the way, Gramps, I keep wondering, what's that? Why, it looks like a key. The tag on it says, Clock Tower. Hot diggity, I found us the key. Now let's get to that clock tower. Hot diggity. Dude, I fucking hate that. That happens in real life all the time. When you're looking for someone... Oh my god, we all can relate to that. You're in the middle of looking for something. I've done it so many times. I don't know where my phone is! I can't find my phone anywhere! And it's in your hand. Your mom lost her glasses on her head. Oh no, I've done that one too. Wait, I've done that one too though. <laughs> check your face. Yeah, yeah, you should check your face. Sometimes we forget though, man. Yeah, shit, where are my keys while driving? Oh, I've done that too. Your car is literally on. Like, you turned your car on. It is in the ignition. And you still can't identify where your keys are. Okay. That one hurts. Katsia, my persona's scared. I don't like this. Oh, they're warning me that there's a boss battle coming up, I guess? I'm gonna take that as a warning to save my game. <laughs> I 
All right, double save. in here. My perfect hair is going to get muzzed. Looks like Mr. Hanya's not here either. Let's hurry and break the big clock so we can get out of here. But that feeling a moment ago... What's the matter? Is there something on my face? Uh, Undy boss! Behind you! Not be. Huh? I said that time must not be set free. I said it so often. He disappeared, but I feel like I've seen him before. Yeah, look up there! Joker. <laughs> Thank you for cleaning the chat. I appreciate it. Mods, um, uh, d feel free to time people out. I would, I would appreciate it. <laughs> time people out for longer. Because, uh, yeah. People are being just plain stupid if they're gonna say shit. I got no sympathy here, okay? Is that Joker? The clean emote. You guys actually... I trust, I trust the, the clean emote. Y'all be nailing it. Thank you. I appreciate it. <clears throat> Principal Hanya, so you were mixed up with Joker. The emblem curse and everyone acting weird is all because you teamed up with Joker, isn't it? Fess up! Foolish girl, how dare you? The emblem curse is a divine punishment brought on by the student's poor conduct. You fools forget that you're students and waste your lives worrying about dating and fashion. You brought this curse on yourselves, though I didn't think the rumor Cuss High started would come true. But if they'd make a wish to Master Joker, the students' faces would return to normal in no time. Not only that, but following Master Joker is the essence of having a chance to get a fulfilling life. So what did he give you? Not me, you ask. My wish was to become a principal beloved by his students, as well as the fine maid that you now see. Joker, weren't you out for- wait, what? Okay, whatever. <laughs> I had to double check that one. J Joker, weren't you out for revenge on us? What's the point in granting a stupid geezer's wish? The seven Pleiades set the frozen time free. Revenge isn't my only motive. This is between myself, the giver, and you, the thief. A battle with Tatsuya Suo for my dream. I'll never let you destroy my dream again. I won't make the same mistake twice. Is he crying? Time is free again. Heed the sound of the bells that toll for your dreams. Damn it. You're not going anywhere. What? There. Get out of our way. Come, fools. This tower will be your detention room. Glory to the mass. Oh. <laughs> Ooh. 
Hey, hey. And you call yourself a teacher? Tough love must be applied to delinquent students. I'll teach you the dignity and authority of a proper principal. <laughs> Okay, this is pretty funny. They were talking about Hanako. Hanako is not affected by fire or physical, but we're fighting the principal. Hama! With one less mod here, please be on your best behavior. I would appreciate it. We work together. Ginkgo now. Oh my god, even here. I, I, I just saw that. Oh my god. Why? that portrait though. That's a lot of damage. Everybody only knows Ginkgo now. No! Chad, don't do this. should turn it off. Okay, that move really hurts.
weak to fire. I've been doing this fight wrong. Chill drill. Pushing off the gears. What are we even standing on then? Oh my god. Yukino is so much stronger. Whatever drill? What does that mean? Rude. Are we fighting the principal? He's an asshole. Always was, always will be. Pushed more and more backwards. Yukino is just the one standing back here, you know. A nice block. Oh. Like, he's got to be close to dead. Oh, I guess he's on his knees now. So that means that he's dying. Okay, there is an animation difference.
Oh, I got another rank up. Nice. I really should be using the personas for that. need to focus on that, I think. Um, Esper, just be very careful with that question. <laughs> I don't want chat to necessarily answer, but yes, as of right now, we just see some similar characters in, in the stories, but yeah, that's a... I don't want chat to answer that question. Because nine times out of ten, chat says way more than they should. <laughs> let's let's not. But yes, as far as I have seen, there are the characters. There are some characters in the story, but yeah, it, besides characters, I'm not sure. Hey, we beat him. And we got a lot of money, too. Hey, 120 bucks off the teacher. Let's go. Teacher budget? Pfft, what's that? I did it! We won! Now tell us everything you know about Joker! What the? Careful, everyone. It's collapsing. Hey, there goes the emblem. I hope nobody died because of that. What if some students were like, uh, standing at the bottom? Ow, is everyone okay? Hey, wait, you bastard. Guidance sessions are over for today. So long as you defy Master Joker and will never find peace. Pretty sure he just fucking died. Isn't this the fourth floor? I doubt even that would kill him. What do you mean that doubt that would kill him? We're four stories high! What? Joker, he's so alone. He's struggling with a sin in the depths of his heart. He reminds me somehow of Tatsuya kun. I feel like I know him from somewhere. I shudder, but when I I shudder when I behold his face, the moon reveals to me my own likeness. You, doppelganger, you pale companion. Why do you mimic my love sickness that tormented me at this place for so many nights in the past? That's from a poem called Der Doppelganger. Have you heard it? Heard of it, Tatia? Uh, Maya-san, you're not suggesting that Joker is Tatsuya's doppelganger, are you? Oh no, I just thought they were some similarities. Ignore me, Tatsuya-kun. Wait, what should we do now? Hanya got away and took only our only lead to Joker with him. What do you mean Hanya got away? Hanya's fucking dead! He just jumped off of a fourth floor building! Hanya got away. What? No, he's dead. He's fucking dead, bitch. <laughs> Think positive, guys. You have to. At times like this, we're not out of leads. Just yet. Let's chase the rumors. They'll surely lead us straight to Joker. 
Hey, that's a great idea. Hanya did say did say that the emblem curse was started by some students from Kas High. Whoa there, there is no one at Kasugiyama High whom the great Michelle knows of that would start such a rumor. We'd be wasting our time with checking it out if we're gonna start if we're gonna search, let's search somewhere else. Start start somewhere else. start somewhere. Um, yeah. Well, the editor of our school paper is looking for our info on Joker and rumors. Maybe she's found something by now. We can probably find Cozy at Peace Diner in Yumazaki. How about it? Oh my gosh! I heard the principal went to Clock Tower to lift the emblem curse. Did you see him? Wait, was he here when the Clock Tower was collapsing? No, he's not dead, is he? He's dead. No! He died trying to protect us? Oh my god. What was that about? I hope this doesn't start any weird rumors. Come on, let's head for Peace Diner. This fucking camera, man. I'm so okay. There we go. Thank you, chat. I really appreciate the clean emote. Because <laughs> I also, whenever I see you guys spam it, I also know to not read the chat for a bit. It, it, it like gives me a tell to like, oh, don't look, don't read. Cause it's easier to see emotes in my peripheral vision, but I obviously can't read in my peripheral vision. So I see emotes and, I'm, and it gives me a tell to not look. So thank you. It's really helpful. <laughs> it's like surprisingly super, super helpful. If you don't see the emote, um, type in exclamation point BTTV. Uh, you won't be able to see it if you're in uh, mobile, but you need BTTV to see it. Yuki's probably right. Miss Saiko seemed like an understanding and beautiful woman. You're lucky to have her in charge of your class. Lisa's Cantonese lesson number 10. Hi, Mei means really or seriously? Remember that. Yeah, you say it all the time. No use for this place anymore. Why not convert it to a storage room? I guess you can't really do that. Now that Hamya's gone, I think this room has brightened up a bit. Might as well make Miss Saiko the new principal while we're at it. <laughs> but yeah, the Nightbot command, so you want to follow that link uh, and download BTTV. If you don't already use BTTV on your PC, uh, yeah, you definitely want to install it. It enhances your Twitch experience by like 50,000. You get a way better Twitch experience. But yeah, unfortunately, if you're on mobile, it doesn't work. Yep, it should work on any uh, any browser. It doesn't, it doesn't matter. Pretty sure it's not Google Chrome exclusive. I am so fucking... Ugh, I hate this camera. God damn it.
Which way? Okay, I want to go see the courtyard again. Oh. Oh my god, they're not, like, praising that, are they? Miss Ideal, the clock's been destroyed, but it's too late. One line of the Oracle is already fulfilled. The Wheel of Fortune is already moving. It's possible that no one can stop it now. You should all be prepared. We'll never forget him. We'll pass his legend on down to our juniors, and to theirs after them, the hero principle of sevens. Principal Hanyo, why? Why did you have to die? Thank you, Principal Hanya, and farewell as we look with reverence on our teacher's elegance. It's the statue of the principal that's rumored to walk around. Seeing it polished to such a sheen grates on your nerves. This won't be one of those rumors, is it? He is not gonna die for real, right? Maya san, she's a character sometimes. By the way, Tatsuya, is that big rock a Hiramon stone? We had something like it at St. Hermelin, too. It's a Nararado stone, really. I guess it does seem different from the one I remember. It creeps me out a little. Yikes, I think it's a little late now to start suggesting he lived. Well, so what? Nothing we can do now. No use crying over spilled milk, I guess. It was just another student prank. What? Maya? Excuse me? <laughs> A memorial service for the principal. Uh-oh, this is because of what you said, Tatsuya. I'm washing my hands of this one. I gotta go to class 2B. I forgot about that. Before we leave here, we're going to class 2B. Why am I facing south again? Holy fucking shit. This camera can fuck right off. Oh! Oh, wait, did I? Okay. I need to go to class 2B. Was it you? Oh! Oh! She running! Well, I don't know what happened. Do you want my autograph? Do you want my autograph? I don't know about you guys, but I would love having Michelle's autograph. back here first. <laughs> it's cute how embarrassing Kichi Kun is. I bet this will stay with him for a long time. Wish I could relive my high school days. 
Wait, so how old are you? Kind of impressed. Looks like Akechi has a sweet side. Little girl, that was one whopper of a kiss. I doubt we'll meet again, though. What? Lisa's Cantonese lesson number seven. You say Kalmina when you're asking for help. Okay. I heard it was the principal who lifted the curse, but the boss did his part too. As thanks, I gave him my first kiss. Oh! That's what happened? Oh, God. Akichi getting some. Okay. <laughs> Jeez. You want some? Come. I need a savior. Let's get out of here. I probably should have checked the rooms. <clears throat> Let's go to the diner. Thank you. I'm going to Silverman Manor. He really does worry about Lisa after all. I think he seems like a wonderful man. What do you think? Why do you think Lisa's so harsh with him? Fathers, huh? I did pretty much everything on my own, so I don't really need to, I don't really feel the need for one. Dang, girl, okay. Principal really died? Yikes, I guess this has gone beyond a prank. Well, it'll be fine, right? He died because of a rumor, so one can probably bring him back to life. Let's spread that rumor at sevens. I wonder if Hamia really did die. He probably had the student's best interests in mind. It was just the way he went, up, went about it. Well, he got what was coming to him. See if they stop me from going here again. Yeah. Just checking in, see if I can see anything more fun. Ow, the moment I stepped in here, my scar, but my head started hurting. Oh, I'm okay. It'll go away soon. It just flares up from time to time. Oh, that's not a good sign. Wow, small world. There was an Alea shrine back in Mikagecho. That's where we met Philemon. I forgot that was at Alea shrine. Oh man. That kind of speaks volumes. Um. Shrine is actually only 10 years old. It was rebuilt. Do you know the rumor that a girl's ghost appears here from time to time? No. There was supposedly a girl inside when the shrine burned down. She still plays here after 10 years, all alone. I wonder why she can't rest in peace. Either she doesn't know she's dead, or she's waiting for someone. like if people are real oh god whoa what's the theater i want to go to the theater mm -hmm. oh 
Welcome to Smart City's Climax Theater. Is this your first time here? My name is Mitsugi, and I'll be your guide to the theater. Nice to meet you. Here you can view films using the most advanced technologies available. They say that the pictures are so clear and crisp that it feels almost as if you're really experiencing the events of the film. You'll also earn points each time you watch a movie all the way to the end. These points will really add up. Your membership level is determined by the amount of points you have. You'll start at Black Raspberry and work your way up. Of course, the better patron you are, the happy happier I'll be to see you visiting our theater again and again. Wasn't my impeccable service and, ma and masterful explanation enough? You've got to be joking. We're already giving you the unparalleled experience of seeing the most realistic movies known to man. What more could you want? Uh, School of the Heart, part one. An incident occurs where you attempt to interview a charismatic teacher at St. At, at Hermelin. Upon receiving a request from Nameless, the Velvet Room pianist, the party goes to Karu Kozaka High. Okay. Um, let's go to the Persona Thief. While on quests, the party stats, personas, and items will remain the same. Experience of demon information gained in battle will be retained in the main game. You cannot save during quests. Depending on the quest and your playstyle, it may take a lot of time. What? What am I doing? Quests may contain material that can be found harmful or offensive. Select abandon from the system menu in the command. What the fuck? I do not agree to these terms. Yo, what are you signing me up for? What the fuck? No. I'll, I'll come back later. That is not what I was expecting. Detective agency and start rumor. Oh, the lucky cat statue! Put in a hundred more yen. I'm gonna put in five more dollars. I look forward to more. It noticed that I fed it 20 times. Five more dollars. Looks like Tadashi ordered off to see that secret menu too. She she's such a schemer when it comes to that stuff. At least he didn't try to get a didn't get a, such a great weapon. I'll let it slide this time. What in the world do I see in that guy? Now that Dukino I remember so cold even during our heartwarming reunion. Oh, reunion. I don't remember you, sorry. Uh oh shit, I keep pushing the wrong buttons on my controller. Okay. Spread rumors. I thought I could start a rumor. Almighty oh, Strauss, thank you so much for the tier one sub. I appreciate it. I think Lisa's plan would be hard to pull off. Rumors don't spread unless they get at people's fears or desires. I doubt a rumor meant to get rid of someone that every uh, rid of someone that everyone in the city wants to be would get gain much traction now. I don't have much hope for Ikichi Kun's idea either. We're not simply we're not dealing with someone who'd fall for such a simple trick. 
I've been thinking, if Joker shows up when anyone calls, why didn't why don't we just call him up again? We got Maya-san and Yukino-san on our side now. Don't you think we could take him if it's five to one? Should we try the undie boss plan? Hey, maybe we can spread the rumor that Joker is really weak. It might come true and help us. I don't know about helping us win, but oh god. Boom. 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 What happens if I go back to the velvet room? I should probably figure out how shit works in this game. This really takes me back. I'm older now, obviously, but these guys haven't changed a bit since then. It could be they've looked like this since long before I found out about this place. We're human because we dream, huh? If we're if what we see when we're asleep are dreams, then to imagine your ideal self is to dream too. Igor creeps me out, man. That's a lot of cards needed. Oh my god, I'm sitting here thinking like, oh yeah, six cards is a lot. 88! about this mechanic anymore. It sounded cool in theory, but now I'm having every kind of doubt you could possibly have. Let me save. Now that I saved my game. Okay. So let's talk to her. What would you like to talk about? Ask about the theater. Very well. I'll explain how our theater works. At our theater, you must select a film. You can leave your seat when the, while the film is showing, but if you do, you will not earn points for watching it. Is there anything else? You would like to learn more about the ranking system? From the bottom, the ranks are Black Raspberry, White Glove, Bronze Man, Silver Palm, Golden Bear, and our highest honor, Platinum Light. This makes no fucking sense. In order to raise your member rank, you will need to watch films all the way through to the end. Please try to raise your ranking as high as you can. You won't earn any money or items or anything, but it's fun. I won't earn anything. If there are no rewards, why would I do it? Okay, um... Oh, I just realized at the top it says Director Atlas. And the actress in oh, the there's a max enemy level. I didn't look at that. Oh shit, I was about to go in here. Never mind. I'm leaving. I. Oh Jesus Christ, I was about to go in there. Dan Trick, thank you for the 28 months. I appreciate it. Okay, I'm leaving. Pachinko? Wait, Pachinko? I'm there. I'm going right now. 
Pachinko Silver! I mean, hold it. Tatsuya kun, you're still a high schooler. Are you hitting on me? If you are, I hate to break it to you, but I'm a little busy. Oh, you weren't? <laughs> Sorry about that then. That reminds me, do you go to Cuss High? Because I saw a group of Cuss High kids going into Zodiac a moment ago. Do you know what they're up what they're up to in there? You're gonna have some fun too? Of course you are. Yumazaki is the district for kids. Wall to wall entertainment. Moo, the hottest amusement center. Giga Macho, a record store with a recording studio. Anima Mundi, home of the latest fashions. A guy my age could easily spend an entire day here and never get bored. And the girls here are a few. <laughs> if I'm gonna date someone new, I'd rather go with a cuss high guy. Everyone at sevens is under the principal's thumb. Boring. A city for the young. That's what those layabouts think. For us men making an honest day's pay, this place is part of society too. By the way, are you from Kasugiyama High? This place is usually packed with seven kids, but I rarely see them anymore. Gold. Dude, this is a fitness center. Oh, I get it. You think you can compete with me in there? Well, I think you'll find your efforts will go to waste. Wow. Oh, Peace Diner, that's where we're supposed to go. I finally found it. Casino? Oh, they let me go to the casino, though. The manager has stepped out. Time to go behind the counter and steal all the money. Just kidding. Inveterate gambler. I heard you can gamble here, so I came all this way, but apparently it was just a baseless rumor. I heard the houses had its own propriety coins to play the games, but I don't even see a manager here. Hey, Tatsuya! Think we could spread the rumor about this place at the detective agency? Let's give it a try! You told me to do that last time and there are no rumors to spread, bitch! You know, I heard a rumor you can gamble here. I never heard of anyone making bank, though. This reminds me, I had a friend who loved to gamble too. He'd be off in his own little world playing poker or blackjack when we had when we had serious problems to deal with. Could there be an underground casino here? I never heard about anything like that at work. Weird. What? That can't be right. I was told there was a casino here. I even heard which game had the best odds. I bet there's some secret to it. Do you know anyone who hears a lot of rumors? They're doing some cleaning up ahead. You think we're always cleaning this place? Ah, wow, you're good. They're always doing cleaning. It's always closed. Sussy baka. <laughs> oh. Rate of one? That's rude. Timing you out for that. Uh, thank you, Mello, for the raid. I hope you had a great stream. It's the Join Forces Blackjack Machine. This kind of makes me want to go back to the park. I didn't talk to the rumor monger there. I forgot that that's like the plot thing you're supposed to. Zodiac's a club, but you've never been inside, have you, Chinyan? I haven't been around here lately either. You know how guys from Zevens can't come here anymore because of that disease? We hear Cus High students have stepped up instead. I'm leaving! I just want to hit up the park. Ah, it's you. Uh, I want to ask about rumors. What kind of rumor do you want to hear? Oh, moo rumors. Yeah, yeah, yeah.
frank, frank, frank. So many sirens going off in the background. All right, well then, would you mind sharing your own rumors with me first? So demons really do exist. That's far-fetched. I finally, personally think it's more likely that evil lurks in people's hearts. My turn then. Do you know the, a large arcade in Yumazaki called Moo? It seems that they offer real gambling. The, oh, the rumor is that poker is the easiest game to win. Ooh, you hear that? You got me just play some poker. Magazine sweepstakes. Tamaki at Kuzunoha Detective Agency is a real devil summoner. Is that an actual job? I've never heard of it. My turn. You know the magazine sweepstakes? It seems people with real weapons and rare... win real weapons and rare items. It's hard to win, but the prizes are good. What can this old man do for you today? Vods are here. If Vods are gone, it's probably Twitch. Just check back later when Twitch isn't a piece of shit. Oh, wait! It always is. Uh, all right. Well, then, would you mind sharing your own? Okay. I got apparently a lot to share, man. <laughs> I like how that's a rumor to share. The principal of seven suddenly grew some hair. Uh, the mall, the mysterious owner of Time Castle, secretly selling real weapons. Their quality and price is average. He's a rather suspicious man who talks as if he can see through people. He even calls himself a count. So this rumor count comes as no surprise. Okay. Wait. I guess that's the only one left. Okay. Ring a die. Something terrible will happen when the clock at seven starts. Uh, the mall called Lotus here in Ring a die. Rosa Candida. Uh, you can actually buy real armor. That armor is this year's trend. A rube was here talking about it until a moment ago. Okay. So now I got a whole bunch of rumors. Yeah, rumors counteracting rumors. It's fine. I'm trying to figure out how this game works. Whoa, too fast, too fast. Calm down, calm down. There we go. There's a casino at Moo. It's easy to win at poker. This is so weird. It's like we live in a bubble. It's like... This kind of reminds me of another game. Whew. Sorry, the yawning. This kind of reminds me of another game. Hint, hint, wink, wink. Not gonna name anything. Um, it's like we live in a bubble where everybody, everybody's wishes just, just come true. Um, so weird. So, so weird. So that means like somebody has to be the source of it. Maybe that person is Maya because of, uh, her... Headache or whatever? I don't know. Seems a little bit different. And she also knows a lot, which is very interesting. Like, she comes in... She's like this... She comes in not knowing much, and then all of a sudden she knows stuff. It's weird. Like, she's a journalist, sure, but she seems, like, clueless about shit, and then all of a sudden she just, like, tends to know stuff. So we live in a bubble where wishes come true. I don't know. I'll come up with more theories on, like, the center of it all, but 
Yeah, it's so much weird shit. It's just, it, like, ever since the start of this game, we live in this bubble, so that means, like... It's weird shit, man. This game is weird. The cork board? You want me to get the cork board? I don't know if I'll get the cork board, man. I don't, I don't think so. Spread more rumors. You can buy weapons at Time Castle. Decided on Bayonetta, honestly. If you guys requested enough, then maybe I'd consider it more. I might watch a few friends play Bayonetta 3 to see if it's something I would like. No, I'm not I don't I don't know, actually. I've considered it though. I'm just undecided. So now if I go back to Moo. Fortune's real. No, I need coins first. Okay, welcome to Moo. You can redeem coins for prizes. Hundred coins? Maybe I'll do fifty coins. I I'm just gonna go gamble. So, prizes. You can redeem cards? Oh! Adds recarm to Persona skills? Oh my god! Bitch! What? Also, I love his earrings. His earrings have dice on them. Yeah, I didn't notice his earrings. But yeah, I've heard good things about Bayonetta. Maybe, maybe. We still have a lot to play, so like I have to play Persona 2 and then uh, Danganronpa Ultimate Summer Camp. And then uh, I was gonna spend a couple days on Life is Strange. I know that those are short games, but... I have codes to give away for Life is Strange as well. I was interested. I know they're, they're short games, so it shouldn't be long. And maybe I could after that? I have to watch. It depends on how long it takes us, because like in December, I know that Crisis Core comes out, and I obviously love that game and story, so I'm playing the shit out of that. It's like Crisis Core comes out December, January Fire Emblem comes out, February, Forspoken comes out, and Yakuza, uh, sorry, Like a Dragon Ishin comes out. March, another game is coming out. I don't remember. Like, there's games just coming out left and right, man. We'll, we'll see, we'll see. Yeah, probably not Mario Rabbids. Hmm. Alright, I want to gamble. Apparently, I can win at poker easily. I should go play poker. Play the Join Forces machine? No. I want to play poker.
Oh my god, Maya. I guess it's in the bag, but this looks like a... Oh, this is a blackjack table. Oh, this is bingo! It, it, wow, it does wonders when you, like, flip the fucking screen around. Am I right? These are basic slot machines, vending, bingo, blackjack. All right, I'll come back later, man. Bikini line. Oh, let's go there. A tanning salon that cures disease? Isn't it usually the other way around? Or have rumors also done something to this place? If you sit under the lights here, your wounds and even diseases get cured. That's what a classmate of mine said anyway. I don't get people who do this stuff. What's that? What's, what? Are, what are they? What are they gonna do if it leaves behind liver spots? Unbelievable. Hmm. Don't you think if you want to tan, you should hit the beach? I don't really like this fake tan stuff. Expressionless woman. That shopkeeper said he used to be a tennis player who made nationals. But look at his body. It has to be a lie. Why, the other day he was going on about how their special light cures wounds and disease. How gullible and those girls to are those girls to believe that. Yikes. Oh my god. Oh my god, that face. Oh my god. Serves up, dude. Hey, how's it going? Check me out. Am I cool or what? Anyway, welcome to Bikini Line. Which course did you have in mind today? So, what are you in the mood for? Talk to bro, bro, bro. Just bro. People say tanning beds are bad for your skin, but not here. We use special lights. Not only does it give you an amazing golden coating, it's good for your health. We can heal any wound or disease in an instant. Sure, I'll tell you how this works. If you select heal, our tanning beds will restore your HP and SP, plus cure any status ailments like poison in the bargain. Alright, I'm considering it for the poison. Just kidding! You can just live with poison, bitch! Get good! You don't need to cure that shit. Mm -hmm. It's a little expensive, but since it heals all of you, it's cheaper in the end. Is that it for you? No, I'm leaving. Don't forget to bring that cutie with you. Tony's shop! The accessories here have style. I like a lot of his stuff. But I doubt you'd understand, Tatsuya. Wow, what are you trying to say, bro? What are you trying to say? I don't know if I'm like too bright or not now. Is this stuff really that stylish? Ikichi seems to be in love with them, but I don't see the appeal. I've always been so cripplingly shy that I couldn't even talk to anyone, but now all that's changed. I asked to become outgoing and then I made up my mind and asked him out. There is a god. We already have pet names for each other. He's Poppy and I'm Mummy. Don't we sound like a married couple already? Life is good. I'm on a for my first day today. Oh my god. <laughs> oh Jesus, okay. Uh, she suddenly asked me out. I'm so nervous. She's the one who suggested we come here, too. I thought I had no chance with her because she's always a always avoid me. This feels like a dream come true. That reminds me. Miho and Shibo used to drag me to the shop a lot. 
It's like he, it's like, it's not like he ever changes up the stuff he has. It's so stupid. Ooh, this dolphin brooch is so cute. Ever seen a real dolphin, Tatsuya-kun? I saw them a lot when I used to go, when I used to be scuba diving. Which reminds me, it's been a while since I went. I've been so busy with work. Oh, oh God. Tony. Your nose, I'm so sorry. Oh, God, Tony. Poor guy. Oh, I feel terrible. That nose. The face. Genuinely feel terrible. Hello, mister. Thanks for coming. What do you think? Good, isn't it? These are all of my art pieces. Very trendy. Very hip. I make each one of these by each one of these by hand. Buy them all, what do you think? I give a good discount for the girls. I'm leaving. So sad I am. Yeah, I'm, I'm going. Oh yeah, you know the new leader at Cuss High? I hear he's stronger than the old boss. I wonder what he's like. Oh, you're so cool. Wait, what school do you go to? Oh, sevens. <laughs> then you suck. Cuss High is the best now. Sevens is old and busted now. I'm bored with those guys. I want a boyfriend from Cuss High. It's like, I'll take anyone who goes there. Oh, are you hitting on me? <laughs> You're the eighth one today. Like fish in a barrel, having him make me cute was a good idea. May being a normal high schooler wasn't worth making any cash, wasn't making me enough cash lately. Guess it's worth listening to rumors sometimes. I wonder how he'd react if I wore something like this. But, oh, it's you, Tatsuya. Didn't see you there. Sorry. I was just talking to myself. Yeah, Yukino? What's with this old lady? Why is she hitting on my Tatsuya? I kind of hate her now. Looks like that girl over there is into Cus High students. Chalk another girl up to my sinful charms. I wonder sometimes if Hanakoji-san would think better of me now. I'm not the kid I used to be. Tom, I have another request. Would you be okay with getting a uh, Count Dino for me? <laughs> I want Count Dino to be with me. Everyone, Count Bino. He's here. to the Anima Mundi, where all fashion springs from. Uh, we're gonna make small talk. You're a high school student. Sevens, right? I see. Oh, I was just appreciating how cute you are. So, what do you think of our clothing line? Yumazaki is the birthplace of fashion, after all. Aren't they all wonderful? Is there anything else I can help you with? Okay, I'm just gonna leave. I'm good. All right, last place, Satomi Tadashi before we go to Peace Diner and plot. Oh. Oh. 
Oh, that's right. It's this song. Oh, yeah. I should buy some medicine for my friend. She always goes so too far with her training and ends up hurting herself. Your friend? I was just looking at the health food and Nikichi recommended some for me. Why in the world does he know so much about them? All right, peace, diner. That's weird. Cozy's not here. I thought she'd be munching on a big piece burger. I want a big piece burger. Huh? Hey, is that you, Lisa-san? Fancy meeting you here. Huh? Oh, yeah. You're on Cozy's newspaper staff. Uh, Chikari? Rumor monger Chikari. Oh, didn't remember me for a minute there, huh? Well, that's okay. It clicked in the end. Yep, that's me, Chikarin. A writer, also known as Rumormonger. She's scatterbrained, but excels at digging up scoop. Perfect timing. Have you seen Cozy? Uh, thanks for reminding me. I was looking into the emblem curse with Cozy Senpai. She found out the Kuskai guys who spread the rumor about the disease were at Zodiac, so she went to infiltrate the club and talked to them. Infiltrate? I didn't see... I didn't know Fatty had it in her to pull off a stealth mission. Hey, pay attention, Undy Boss. Sounds like it was a Cus High student who spread the rumor about that disease. There's no way my guys would stoop to that. I didn't teach him to be cowards. Fatty must have gotten some bad info. Even Hanya said Cus High did it. There's, that's two witnesses now. Are you still gonna try and play dumb? Even if it's true, I bet it was just out of jealousy. If I go and yell at them, those rumors are just gonna... All right, that's enough. We get the point. Let's just go to Zodiac and learn the truth for ourselves. And if Kalsai soon started the rumor, we'll have Akichi to set them straight, okay? Zodiac's that club not far from here, right? Well, shall we head on over? This theme goes off so hard. She really does talk like a Victorian maid, huh? Oh, I mean that part-timer. She's a huge period drama nut, so I told my friends she probably talks that way in real life. It sure enough, color me surprised. Those Cus High students were the ones who really spread that rumor. Ugh, I bet Undie Boss is part of it too. I'm the one who should have been saying Kihei the here. My guys would never do that, and I'm not taking this airhead's word that they did. Of course I heard. Rumor has it he's stronger than the old boss. Man, boss, man. Things sure are changing to cuss high. Oh, um... Hey, Kazuya, did you hear about the new leader at Cuts High? They say someone like that popped up recently. Running after scoops is my specialty. I know a lot about rumors going around the city. If you tell me what you know, I'll deal, I'll steal the same deal. Okay. If you keep your finger on the pulse of the city's rumors, you can pick up on those cases easily. That's what I do best. The other staffers at the school paper call me rumor monger Chikarin now. Okay. Never mind. Uh, wait, what's going on? Streamlabs having issues? Uh, not anymore, no. Did something happen? Did you do something? Nothing is wrong on my end. Right now, everything's working. So yeah, let me know. Joker is behind this too. That cozy girl is in danger. We should go to Zodiac. Okay.
<laughs> All right, to Zodiac. Here we go. Mmm. Okay. Notice we are closed today. A little something. Well, you need to let me know the problem because right now I am aware that there are no problems. So, yeah, just be specific. If you did something, let me know. Because, uh, yeah, I would like to fix problems, but if I'm not aware, that I can't fix it. Anna Yoshikawa. Sister, no! You can't keep that up or it'll ruin, it'll ruin your health even worse. Then you'll never run again. Oh, Anna. She looks cute, but she looks dead inside. A tip. Uh, tips aren't Streamlabs anymore. They're through Stream Elements. So, that would be a separate issue, because Stream Labs alerts are working now. Stream Elements might be having problems. Give me a second. Well, Stream Labs just sucks. So I stopped supporting them for tips right away. Okay, there, it is showing. Okay, it's showing that you donated 50. Let me see if I can, thank you so much. It should be working though. I'm not sure why it wouldn't be working right now. Cause normally the alerts uh, jump scare me. <laughs> because I'm dumb. Yeah, it's actually not working. Wait, why? I'm so sorry, give me one second. Refresh the cache, maybe? Refresh browser when scene becomes active. No. It should be here. Try it again. There it is! I had to refresh the cache. There we go! Hi, Crystal. Guess what? I had brain surgery to fix a condition called trigeminal neuralgia. Isn't that fun? No. Brain surgery is not fun. Do not recommend. Say hi to Tom for me. Brain surgery? Legit? Oh my god. I hope you're doing good now, fam. Thank you so much for the $50, though. I really appreciate it. Didn't have to do that. Hope all is well. All right, so uh, Anna. Now all alerts should be working now. Jesus Christ. I hope your recovery is going well, fam. Uh, Anna Yoshizaka. Anna. Anna Yoshizaka. A dropout from Seven Sisters High, currently dissolute, but she was star of the track team before her incident. Incident. Sister, am I that much of an annoyance to you? So far, so good. Yay! Glad to hear it. Glad to hear it. I hope he keeps up. You idiot! Don't do this. Trying to be something you're not isn't cool. Who are you? Me? I'm Yukino Mayuzumi, just an apprentice photographer. And why are you getting in my business? Take a hike, will you? Alexander! Thank you so much for the raid! I appreciate it! That was really sweet. Welcome, welcome! Hi everyone, I'm playing Persona 2 for the very first time. I hope you guys had a good time in Alexander's stream today. Welcome on in. You really like my streams? Have a good one. Oh, thank you. Well, that's very kind of you. I really appreciate it. I'm, I'm glad you enjoy what I do. Thank you. <laughs> Welcome on in. <clears throat> okay, there we go. 
Sorry, I'm still making sure my alerts work and everything. Because that was also supposed to work. It's okay, though. But yeah, welcome on in. It's my first time playing Persona 2. And we're kind of, like, near the beginning still of the game. Uh, we're just, yeah. I would still consider this the beginning of the game, so we're not very far in. You should take the advice people give you. You're the one who will regret it if you don't. Wow, that's stupid. I'm surprised you're not getting angry. It wouldn't change anything. I hate annoyances like this. Dang, this girl seems like super dead inside. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's with the preaching in our place? You think you're hot shit or something? You mopes are seven students, yeah? Better head straight home after school or your scary principal's gonna get ya. That's enough, everyone. I think we all need to be shinier, happier people here. You don't want to make me mad, do you? You're hearing some other music in the background? Is something playing? Oh, I had a YouTube video playing. Jesus Christ, I'm an idiot. Thank you. <clears throat> Yo, it's Sly. Hi, Sly. How are you? Michelle's son. Who gives a damn about you anymore? No one will listen to you. You're not our boss no more. What? You want to repeat that, you worthless punk? We got a new leader, and he's way, way stronger than any boss. All your cronies at Cuss High have switched sides with our new leader, Sugimoto-san. Sugimoto? You mean Hiroki Sugimoto? He's the leader at Cuss High? Quit joking around. Help me! What was that about the new leader being stronger than any boss? Think you could say that again? It's the rumor going around. I heard everyone say it that Cus High's new leader is stronger than the boss. So there's a new head honcho right under the old one's nose. Doesn't that sound a little sudden? Sounds like the result of another rumor. Maybe that Sugimoto's in league with Joker too. It's sure possible there's no way he could take over an entire school that quick without something up his sleeve. Aw, thank you, Hylian. I really appreciate it. Thank you for the donation. It helps the stream so much. By the way, I'm sure you know the rumor about the Seven's emblem being cursed. From what I understand, that rumor started at Cuss High. Do you know anything about it? We spread that rumor because the leader told us to. He said he'd throw mud on Seven's reputation because he hated him. What's up with that? Why would this Hiroki guy have such a grudge against our school? We'll just have to ask him in person. Hey, where's Hiroki now? I he's here at the secret lounge further in. A secret lounge? I'll smack the smile off that cocky bastard's face. Hold your horses there, Andre Boss. Hey, was there a girl in called Cozy here? She was investigating the emblem curse too. I don't know no Cozy, though there was this girl, said her name was Miyabi Hanakoji, who went to see our leader. What? Did you just say Miyabi Hanakoji? Hanakoji-san went to see Hiroki? I gotta go! Wait, Ikichi-kun, it's too dangerous to go alone. And he's gone. Aya, the Undy boss took off by himself. Well, Undy boss aside, we can't turn our backs on Cozy. We should go after him. Ana Yoshizaka, that girl is the same look I did years ago before I met Miss Saiko. Hey, Chinyan, what do you think Cozy asked us not to tell Undy boss her real name? If she was going out with him like Andy Boss said, wouldn't she want him to know? Maybe he was lying about her. If the rumor that the leader is stronger than the boss has spread far enough, Ikechika might be in trouble. Sugimoto is actually kind of a shitty dude. He sucks up this to the strong and stomps on the weak. Huh? Why 
is why is he our leader? Oh, now they think about it. Okay. I've been hearing people talk about Kusai's new leader too. Huh? He's here now. That reminds me, a group of Cus High students headed upstairs a moment ago. I wonder if their new leader was with them. I've heard the rumors for a while now, but it looks like they actually is there actually is a secret lounge somewhere here. They, there must be some kind of special qualification to get in, right? I wonder if I'm eligible. I want to go so bad. Try not to cause any trouble here. Ever since Cus High students started coming around, this place has gone to the dogs. I wonder if the rumor about the maze on the second floor is true. I hear there's a good stuff up there, but I can't go on my own. Okay, let's go. Bye! Uh-oh. It's red down here. Oh! This form of battling is so fast. I love it. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, I said no to the fusion spell. Oh my god! Cast it. Blazing Burst. Oh! Trust me, I know how lucky I am to be able to speed battles up. Don't worry, I grew up in this era too. I played retro games too. That are equally as bad with this shit. I, I went through the pain. It's a bit painful without it, huh? I can imagine, man. All right, we got three points remaining. Chat, what are we going to do with them? Suspicious. is dying. Oh my god, her name is Yuki now. Yukino is now Yuki. Oh, I found the upstairs. Oh god. did go all the way through? Oh, cool. It's 
She's not dead yet, though. Oh, there's a guy here? The fuck you doing, man? Hold it right there! Did you remember your mask? You can't get into the party without one. If you forgot yours, there should be extra somewhere. Look around, you'll find them. I gotta look around in my video game. Let me save my game. Should be talking to them and not doing this as much actually but i don't wanna i can just play the whole game like this Imagine if I actually did play the whole game like this, though. Even the bosses. I gotta find a mask. What is this shit? Oh my god! Did my foot just get on fire? Zombie DJ. I didn't realize the their names actually. I found medicine. I'm looking for a mask, you idiot. Left or right? Left. Free card? Yeah, just get the random loot, honestly. This door is glowing. Yukino to die. It's the only way to get rid of poison. She leveled up and the poison didn't go away. I'd hear the rumor about the secret lounge too, but actually seeing it for myself is kind of weird. I used to come here about as often as I came to school. When did the city get so messed up? Wrong button. Ikichi's not here either. Won't be in won't he be in trouble if we don't hurry out and go after him? A gathering? I wonder what's that about. It seems like someone summoned them here. I don't like the sound of this. I'm glad that my leg hair is completely gone, but I really hate having to come to these gatherings. Plus B does not equal Z.
It was a shock to find that summons at the bottom of my box lunch. Feels like I'm being watched. I, I totally had a summons in my purse too yesterday. It was like, so, is someone stalking me? It was totally creepy and stuff, but part of the deal was to come to the gathering, so I'm not turned into one of those thingies, so... This is so weird. Get me out of here. Level eight, let's go. Oh wow, Vit helps a lot. Look at all that HP I could be having right now. shaving technique. The 69, sorry guys, I'll let you down. What the fuck? a healing spring. For a price, Trish here will cure your wounds, but her fees are out of this world. Is she really a fairy? She's more devious than your average demon. Aya, who is that? She's so cute! To think that door led to a room like this. Hey, what kind of room is this anyway? This world runs on give and take. Hey, wait, is this your first time here? Then I better introduce myself. Name's Trish. This is my fountain of healing. I'll treat your wounds. A greedy, money-loving fairy. She was kicked out of the fairy realm and can't go back until she's done her, her share of good deeds. Not for free, of course. This world runs on give and take. Give me money and I'll take away your pain. What'll it be? Five thousand yen. Fuck off. There's this magical free way of healing called leveling. Feeling. It's Akichi. He's calling for us, Tatsuya, just up ahead. Oh, that means boss battle, probably? That would check out. You got, like, your classic JRPG dungeon. You always have, like, a healing point right before your boss fight. Does that make sense? I forgot you can use skills, right? Oh, 
Maya got Dia too. Nice. Oh man, I wasted a medicine. pretty strong now. Uh, this seems like the party that I needed a mask for and I don't have a mask. I need a mask to attend a party. I take it this is your first gathering? The rumor is that's true for everyone who was summoned today. You got a card from the lady, right? If you don't have a mask, you won't be able to get into the secret lounge. Yeah, give me yours or something. You're pretty deadly with that katana, Tatsuya. Yeah, she's seen all my strength stat points. One of my old pals was a whiz with a katana, but you're not bad yourself. Bet you're pretty handy with your fists too. No. I'm not. Not so. Well, we shouldn't have any problems if you're that good with the sword. I'll be counting on you, Tatsuya. Lady? Masks? Cards? I smell something fishy here. There's some- there's funny business going on in this place. I'm worried about Ikichi-kun, too. Hopefully we can find a way into the secret lounge. Man, I totally forgot to bring the mask that they gave me. I was like, what now? Good thing there were some spares in that box over there. <laughs> Got him. That stupid boss isn't here either. There's always one bad apple in every bunch. Jeez, he's so self-centered. These gatherings are so lame, but it helps to think of it as a free ticket to a party. It's worth it to have a sim uh, worth it to have a smaller mouth anyway. Sheesh! This fucking camera. Okay. The smoking hot party still going on inside. Okay, well, we got our mask. Let's save our game. Here we go. Oh, man, check it out. The boss... What are you gonna hold up? What are you holding your stomach for? You gotta take a shit? Want me to drop your drawers for you? Hiroki Sugimoto, the new leader of Cus High, seems to have been plotting revenge against Eikichi since his, uh, since his humiliation in middle school. Easy there. You know what's gonna happen to this chick if you bring out your death spirit, right? You ain't shit without that death spirit of yours. What's with their I won't allow any bullying of the weak crap? You only said that because you're weak. That gathering stuff seemed like a pain in the ass, but I'm glad I came in if it meant seeing something this awesome. What the heck? Sheesh. Oh my god, he said sheesh! What? You can't say that. Only I'm allowed to say that. 
Is Fatty here really that important to you? Whatever. She was only tagging along. But if anything happens to Hanakoji-san, you punks are in for a world of pain. What are you talking about? Hanakoji's... No, don't tell him. Please, don't say it. You didn't know. This hand beast here is Miyabi Hanakoji. Really? Are you really Hanakoji-san? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Why? Why did you never say anything? I... I was too embarrassed. I didn't want you to know, Ikichi-kun. Were you guys going out or something? You and Fatty here would be a perfect match. It's nothing like that. I admired the Hanikoji-san I knew back then. Oh. She's your sweetie. You bastard. Say whatever you want about me. I don't care. But anyone who laughs at her is a dead man. Looks like you don't really get what kind of position you're in. Watch closely. He cut her face. That Hiroki guy's the worst. All right, I'm gonna bust out my persona and... Wait, we storm in there, we hurt Akechi's pride. I know it's tough to watch, but this is his moment. You want us to just sit back? Fana, no way! Let's go save them, Tatsuya. All right, Hiroki. You got me. Do your worst. Just let her go. Looks like you're finally getting the picture. Fine! I ain't gonna go soft and take only an arm here. Go to get back what for what you put me through, I'm gonna have to take both arms and legs. Are you still bitching about me pantsing you in middle school? Of course I am. It's your fault that my girl dumped me for that. Maybe your girl dumped you because you're an asshole. You ever consider that? No, oh, no, chat complaining about ads again. Uh-huh, no. <laughs> I can't do anything! That wasn't it. She got fed up with the way you'd pick on anyone weaker than you. That's a lie! You're lying! It was your fault! Everything is! You know what you can do to avoid ads? Subscribe! That's right, damn it. The leader is stronger than the boss, you hear? In that case, I quit being the boss. Ooh, look at Ikichi, though. Ooh -hoo! Dang, man, get him! The leader here might be stronger than the boss. But there's no way Hiroki Sugimoto is ever stronger than Eikichi Mishina. After that beating you put me through, I'm calling it even between us. Dang, Eikichi though. I'm sorry, just don't yank my pants. You've got, I've got no right to act all superior about what Hiroki did. There's no difference between that and what I've done, not really. I acted like a big hero, ordering my guys not to pick on the weak, but that was all just a front. Really, it was just an excuse to beat people up with my persona, and that ain't how a man should act. Yeah, what happened to the usual self-centered, heedless goon that we all know? If nothing else, that stuff you said a second ago, ugh, it was pretty cool. Oh my god. We met Akichi like three hours ago, and he's already got his character development. All right, wrap it up. Roll credits. Even without your persona, you were brave back there, Ikichi Hoon. Sorry for being so mopey. Anyway, I'm done being boss, starting now. Ugh, Hanakoji-san, are you... Well, I guess you're not okay. I'm sorry, Ikichi Hoon. I'm so sorry to have caused you all this trouble. Don't worry about it. The cut on your face, is it... No, don't look, Ikichi-kun. 
I'm sorry. Hanakoji son? All right, time to split, spill it all. If you don't, you're gonna find there's way worse than getting your pants pulled down. I'll talk, I'll talk. What do you want to know? Why'd you order your stooges to spread a rumor that the seven emblems was cursed? The student council president asked me to. He said he'd make me leader with Master Joker's powers if I ruined Seven's reputation. That Yasuo. I turned him down, so he went with the next name on his list. The people here said something about a gathering going on today. What did they mean? There's an organization you have to join once Master Joker grants your ideal. I heard the gathering was an initiation ceremony for it. Which reminds me, I also heard that one of their executives, Lord Lady Scorpio, was gonna be at the gathering. This was gonna be my first time going, so that's really all I know. Come on, just let me go! Looks like you are telling the truth. Alright, you're off the hook, but you better not go near Joker ever again, got it? Well, we have our culprit. Next stop, the Cus High Student Council president. I'm gonna beat the stuffing out of that guy. I was expecting a boss fight. And then nothing happened. Maybe because of my decision to, um... Uh, save Aikichi as opposed to... I let him do his thing. That was quite nice. Snuffy, snuffy. I'm debating on getting a snack right now. Do I do it now? I can wait a little bit. All right, let's get out of here. We're going back to Hirosaka. Wow, it's jumping in here. Are they getting something for the school festival or something? Seems like everyone's excited. Yeah, Yasuo's in charge of it all. And here I thought he was just putting in extra effort for the school. That bastard. He's probably in the student council room on the second floor. I'll beat a confession out of that prick. Let's go. Hey. God, Aikichi. Hold it, we're still setting up so you can't go in. Don't worry, the Kasuga Festival will start soon. Come see us then. This year's theme is the fusion of tradition and fun. That's why we thought about doing a temple festival. We got all the stores and stalls you'd expect from a temple. Come on by once the festival begins. No. Fuck you! That demon looks like he's in the middle of like a split. Council's prepping the masks for the masquerade. They're pretty driven. I don't really care though. 
I wasn't very confident in my looks before, but thanks to a certain someone, I've been reborn. The girls are all over me now. Why don't you have your ideals granted too? I just know it'll change your life. Aw, he did the Joker game too. I guess if it, it can fulfill any ideal, I may as well give it a try. But what should I ask for? Good looks are too common. Good grades would help later in life. Hey, what would you ask for? Um, looks are everything. I guess good looks are the first step towards anything else. I don't think that's really my ideal, though. Oh my god, speaking of looks being everything, have you guys seen that, like, new popular show that's on YouTube called The Button? I don't know if anybody has seen that shit, but holy crap. It, that show is, like, the epitome of you see someone, and if, if you haven't, it, like... It, this this show is a fucking disaster, but um, I can't even describe the premise of the show. Uh, but yeah, basically people going on a date, um, two people sit and there's a button in the middle. You're basically supposed to talk to the person and see if you are compatible. And then at a random point in time, the buzzer will turn red and you have a choice of hitting the button and the first person who hits it, the other person has to like switch out and then it just rinses and repeats. Um, so everybody is so shallow in that show. They're like, if they see the person without even talking to them, if they don't like how they look, they just press the fucking button. It's insane. Like, holy crap. I know it's like a human thing to be attracted to physical features by nature, but like, Man, oh man, I am the kind of person that's like personality over looks. So it's like, it's so cringe to watch. It is so cringe to watch, man. Maybe I'll react to it on stream or something. Maybe we'll watch it, watch one next stream at the beginning or something. It's so bad. Man, just judge it based on looks is so cringe. Dude, uh, I was watching the episode where this guy, they were blindfolded. So they they tried to make it better by blindfolding them so they couldn't judge based off of looks. But the guy asked to hug the girl and then realized that she was fat based on the hug and then pushed, pushed the fucking button. And the worst is that they lie about it. He was like... Uh, what did he- the reason he gave for pushing the button, like, bro, just be honest. But no, he gave some other reason. Oh no, I lost one of Nahabino's teeth. Anyway. Like, bro, the, the show is so cringe. It's so bad. Anyway, so yeah, this just reminded me of that. I fixed Nahabino's teeth. Don't worry, Count Vino is- is back. Looks like the student council is setting up masks for the masquerade. Uh, yeah, it's a little strange. If the masquerade's some kind of in, in, initiation, would that bother giving tickets to new members? No use roping in people who don't care. I agree that masquerade sounds suspicious, but what's Yasuo going to do there? I don't have the first idea. This'll all be cleared up if we can catch that student council president and make him talk. It's not like you had a decent answer, Akichi. I hate this camera. It's so freaking stupid. We'll be exhibiting photos here from our photography club. There will be a little bit of everything from landscape shots to idol snaps. I can't let you see it yet because we're still getting ready, but you should come by once the Casca festival starts. We'd welcome you. I'm a, prop I'm a paparazzi for idols. I always go to the concert hall on concert days and take pictures of those foxy young beauties. That's against the rules? Maybe it is at that. Oh my god. Police! OK, 
Okay, that's this whole floor, right? Well, on the right side. Okay, so now we have to go to the left side. All schools have at least one, at least seven ghost stories, but this place only has one. Once you're in the bomb shelter, you can't find the exit. When I first heard that story, I was so scared that I never went near it. But now, I don't really care. It's quieter in there. By the way, Tatsuya, there's something I need to ask you before we beat the snot out of Yasuo. It's important. You, the big man on campus at Sevens, and me, a raging stud muffin of beauty. Who's cooler? Obviously me. So you want to be rivals, do you? Interesting. Then may the best man win. I'm gonna win. Come on, Tatsuya. That guy over there knows something about the president. Go ask him. No. Why? Hey! We should try asking the guys here where their president is. I bet at least one of them will know. The new, leader, uh, the new leader wasn't stronger than Eikichi at all. He talked the talk, but he couldn't walk the walk. Seems like everyone already knows what happened at the secret lounge. I don't think anyone claiming to be stronger than Eikichi-kun will pop up for a while. Your favorite Persona game? Well, welcome to the stream, Honey Badger. Uh, the president, I think he's in the student council room. No, really, it's on the second floor. Yeah, you liar. <clears throat> Our class is hosting a cafe this year. We even have waitresses. It'll be perfect. I was so looking forward to today because of all the girls who'd show up, but I can't exactly hit them on, that, on this getup. I get upset whenever I see the same people in the chat posting spoilers and shit. I feel like it's always the same people. I'm gonna start banning. Bro, learn a lesson. Please. I understand if it's like a new person coming in. I get that. You can make mistakes, it's fine, but if you're, like, a repeated person doing the same shit and not learning, like, I'm gonna ban you, bro. <laughs> hey, you're hurt. Let me take a look. No. Don't be reckless just because you're young. You won't be able to enjoy the Kasuga Festival if you're hurt. A masquerade? It's just like what was going on at the at that club. I bet Joker set this up too. In any case, it's masks again. I wonder what all this means. You can't go inside the gym yet. We're setting up for the masquerade. Did you know this game has personas in it? I've Massive never spoiler. seen these guys so active before. This is a lot better, I'd say. Uh, thank you, Crimson, for 16 months. Those kinds of comments really don't help either. <laughs> no need to be sassy. I've never seen these guys active. This was how I wanted the school to be. Fights will still break out once in a while, but we'd all have fun. But Yasuo's doing it all wrong. I'll make him pay for this. I want you to see it, Tatsuya. I will. I'm sure tons of girls from other schools will help, will show up. So if we don't make this work, our image rehab efforts will have been for nothing. my 18 years of teaching, have the students ever been so dedicated toward working on the school festival? No, they haven't. This can only be the leadership of our new student council president. My students, right now, you are beautiful. Just beautiful. Oh my god. A masquerade, huh? Isn't this just a fancy name for a party? Why would Joker throw a party? How should I know? Masquerade? That's like a dance party, right? They spread nasty rumors about Seven while they go and throw a dance party? They're seriously k hey! She mad, bro, she mad. Ikichi is an interesting one. Wait, there's a basement. Downstairs.
<clears throat> know what, Tatsuya? Up ahead is a bomb shelter they built way back when. I wonder what it's like in there. Yikes. This sure feels disgusting. Cause I really lives up to its name. Having something like this? Come on, let's get out of here. Oh, don't go in there. It was originally an air shelter, but rumor has it that once you go inside, you can't find the exit. Look, it's just dangerous, okay? We don't want visitors wandering in by accident, so I'm standing guard here. They say that once you enter the air raid shelter up ahead, you never get out. Careful not to wander in there. Seven's Clock Tower, the shelter here. I guess all schools have skeletons in the closet. St. Hermelin did too. Herma Melons. I keep saying the school name wrong. St. Herma Melons. Lol, the boss's command. Don't go in there. Oh, but what if I want to? Oh, this is the student council room. Let's not. Tatsuya, do you have a dream? Uh, me? Well, I... Uh... I'll tell you someday. I want to go out with you and marry you and be with you forever! I heard your ideals would be granted if you play the Joker game, but what's ide what are ideals? Dreams for your future? I don't have any. I don't really care about anything, but right now I'll come. I'll think about the future when the future comes. That's the way to go, right? There seems to be more and more people who don't or rather can't dream. It's kind of sad if you think about it. Uh, it feels like I have fewer classmates lately. Is this just my imagination? I think you should be noticing something like that. Aren't there too many shadow men here? There were hardly any at sevens yet. Sevens yet. There's something strange about this school. Even these guys turned into shadow men. It makes no sense. Everyone was fine a few days ago. Why is this suddenly happening? There was one who escaped the shelter. Something about a mirror he had. I don't even care. The chaos mirror still exists from Persona 1 and is causing everybody's wishes to come true, just like that whole arc that happened. Oh god, that would actually be pretty... Did that happen? Nah, that's... Thinking of, uh, What's-Her-Face's arc, and then... No, that her her mirror. I thought I thought we destroyed it so that she couldn't make any more wishes with the stupid mirror. Anyway. Huh. We decided on a haunted house. Why, you ask? Well, where's the fun in scaring guys? It's not worth doing unless we get some nice high school high pitched screams. What? I don't know about you guys, but I have heard plenty of guys in my life have very high-pitched screams. And it is hilarious and I love it. Yeah, right? Lots of guys have high-pitched screams. If not most, actually. I know it sounds a little cliche, but we're doing a haunted house this year. Wait until you see what we've got in store.
ba -da -ba. Why do the stairs flicker? It's because they're winking at us. Ah, oh, stars are so wonderful. Are you okay? We're gonna have a planetarium here. We're making a cardboard dome to shut out all the light. That'll be our booth. What? It's a Gatheon! Oh god. We're starting to actually take some damage. Oh, I got an Agi card. Nice. Chibi a Gatheon. Isn't he so cute? Anyway, I was gonna heal and then we all leveled up, so I didn't need to heal. Oh. The student council is preparing the masks, but we can't go in without one. Don't you think they're taking this a little too far? Hey, is a boss through and through. He's not just talk. He really does take good care of his own. I'm starting to think it's a shame he's giving up being the boss. Guys like him don't come around too often anymore. Dude, I actually, I just had a thought. I just had a thought. So like, if we are, um, like if we're seeing characters from Persona 1 and uh, from St. Herm Herma Melons, so we've seen Yukino and Miss Saiko and the principal, Tanya so far and a few others that I forgot their name. Um, I will, I will, I'm gonna flip my shit if like Nanjo pops up. Just saying. Nanjo and Keto, although Keto probably wouldn't, but like, I'm just saying. If I see Nanjo, even Ellie, she's so cute, man. Mm. I might die. Now I'm hoping that they show up because like all these other characters are here. It's, it's a possibility. Okay, we, we can't rule out the possibility that they're gonna show up, right? <laughs> I swear I like the other characters too, but Nanjo and Ellie and keto those are my top three that business with the new leader must have woken aikichi kun up he looks a lot more mature now i understand i'm with michelle son on this one i'll carry on without needing anyone's help anymore by the way i have a tip for you that president michelle son is looking for it the, that president that michelle son is looking for is in the student council room yeah i, I am aware Sorry, but I quit being the boss. Are you guys men or not? What are you gonna do if you can't even take care of yourselves? Come on, you have to hang in there. Try your best, and if that doesn't work, talk to me again. I'll help you out as a fellow student. If you quit being boss, what's gonna happen to this school? To us? What's, who's gonna take care of everything? Huh? Look, looks like these guys really look up to Akichi. I thought he would only had those three goons. I admit, I wasn't expecting this. None of us were. That business with the new leader must have woken Ikichi Goon up. Oh, wait, you were the one that said that. Sorry, Maya. Oh. Have you come to see the Hana Akasuga Festival too? I can't remember our school festivals being this well attended before. It must be the work of that new student council president. There, there have been some nasty rumors about him, but he's okay in my book. Ah, uh, seven student, eh? I heard that your school's festival was canceled. I'm very sorry about that. 
I can practically feel how much you feel sorry about that. Yo, Aikichi with the level up, let's go! human in a place like this. Well, I suppose I could kill time with you. By the way, can I give you a psychological test? All you have to do is answer a question. If you were an animal, what kind would you be? I would definitely be a cat. Excellent. Confident and defiant towards humans. I, I approve of that lifestyle. Allow me to pose a question. What do, you, what do your eyes show you? The one I love. No, a peaceful future. What a happy fool. Okay, we're just going with this then. Oh my god, Tatsia with this fucking construction equipment impression. Oh my god, look at the phantom space! That's so cute! Listen. Tatsuya says listen. That means you fucking listen. I'll sign a pact with you. Will you form a pact? Yeah. You're very lucky. Look forward to when we next meet. Okay. He is a happy demon. Someone's anxious. Did you come to buy the manga I drew? I'm still setting up. Why are these people, the students, just casually out here with demons? Like, I'm fighting demons around here and nobody fucking cares. This place is pretty popular every year. We even get cosplayers, so we go all out. Looks like we'll have a ton of female customers this year, so we prepared a special changing room for them. This place is off limits. The manga club next door has dibs as a changing room. Uh, peeping will not be tolerated. Who? Us? We're standing guard. We're standing guard. We're not peeping. No. You ain't worth my time. Yeah, they are just chilling. It's a little weird. Is there anybody who has no dream? I don't understand that at all. Dreams are what make life fun. Dreams. My dream is to... Be with Tatsuya forever! <laughs> I've got so much stuff I always wanted. I'm thinking about going for broke with the Joker game and getting everything. Huh? Why not? That's my dream and all. What? Do you have a better one in mind than I'd like to hear? Uh, think more about the future. That's all fine and dandy, but how do you know what'll happen in the future? How can you base your dreams on that? Does getting what you want count as an ideal? Then if you get it, does that mean your ideal's been granted? Kind of boring. I think ideals are more than that. There's something you'll chase after your whole life. Dreams differ from person to person. I think it's fine that not everyone has the same one. But I think life is about reaching for those dreams. Your ideals are the key to learning your purpose in life. I'll never forget it. A normal meeting, nothing out of the ordinary. And then there was someone with a blue skull. What? Are you the guys looking for the president? Oh, well, in that case, I think he's in the student council room. Yeah, I know, I know.
Our movie's called Scent of the Wind. It's about a son getting revenge on his father for abandoning him. Sounds interesting, huh? We'll be showing it during the Kasuga Festival. You're definitely welcome to come see it. This is the Visual Media Club, and by visual media, we mean movies. We're kind of a film studies club. We're planning on showing a movie we made ourselves this year. We're still getting ready, but I hope you can could, you could check it out. Ikichi's acting weird, and Lisa seems mopey too, for some reason. What's up with them? Wasn't there a transfer student here? Would you happen to know where he is now? Oh, that guy. Nah, he's come to. He hasn't come to school lately. Maybe he's in the hospital or something. I don't know. Okay then. What's up, Ikichi Kun? Do you know this transfer student? Nah, it's nothing. Probably just my imagination. What the hell? What's with Ikichi? He's all broody. The way Ikichi beat up the new leader was the death talk of the school. Looks like his nickname of Death Boss was no joke. Transfer student. Yeah, this class did have one, but I haven't seen him in forever. Doesn't matter. He has nothing to do with me. I'm just depressed. Oh, there's still an upstairs, though. What would I do without fast mode? I don't know what I would do. I would quit. I definitely wouldn't quit. It's not a deal breaker. Yeah, probably we'd still be in sevens, for sure. My stomach is growling so much. I feel like I should get off stream soon, but I want to keep playing the game. Like I'm addicted to it, man. I want to keep playing, but I'm so fucking hungry. That's enough. You're the ones who kept this school in Seven's shadow. All you did was use Seven's as a scapegoat for your problems. How can you be proud of such a sullen school spirit? As long as you guys keep on keep on this way, this place will always be cuss high. Ooh, Maya, fucking hell, dude. <laughs> Sheesh, girl. Sevens is for shit now, while our school festival is rocking it. We'll get tons of visitors for sure. Jealous? Don't deny it. Now Seven is our shadow. Kasuga Yama High will be world famous. You better not let us catch you skulking around here, you cowards. Uh-oh, they pissed off Maya-san. You might not think so, but she gets emotional pretty easily. But then, if it were me, I'd talk with my fists. Sun's so cool. Ha <laughs> ha! Damn girl. Boss, maybe it was us who was the reason everyone calls us cuss high. We don't feel like doing anything. I get that now, but we were only jealous of sevens because we loved our school. That's why. You moron. Then we'll just change things. We gotta make this the best. Holy sh fucking shit, that scared me. On behalf of me and wifey, bon appetit, goofball. I wish I could read that. I, was that poutine and salad? Either way, holy crap, thank you so much for food. I appreciate it. Uh, yeah, you should not be... 
you're probably not bragging about it, but you should not be saying things like you have gone 38 hours without eating. Um, or you either need to elaborate. You don't just say that. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, back down we go. I guess I can go to the student council room now. Food jump scare indeed. No, but thank you. That actually, food sounds amazing right now. I just don't know why in particular. I'm just really hungry today. Normally I'm fine, but like today is just so bad. I forgot to heal. Fuck. I hope I don't die. Oh, I don't need to heal. I just need to level up. Leveling up is the best medicine. Wait. Oh, I went in here. It wasn't showing his green, so I was like, I didn't go in here. Thank you. Ugh. Sorry, I'm not just gonna delete that message. I'm gonna time the person out for longer. Consistently keep being annoying today, please. Sheesh. Learn how to internet. Yeah, we have clean now, and chat's really, really good at using it. Like, you guys are absolute pros. Look at the clean sweepers in the chat right now. Dang, you guys are so good at your job. This new president had to be elected, right? Doesn't that mean he's popular at Cuss? I mean, Cuss and Kiyama, hi? <laughs> Chat, yeah, you're, you're all like my janitors, yeah. I like that. You're all my official janitors. Every single one of you guys in chat has a job right now. Uh, Michelle-san, you're safe. That's great. Glib. Yeah, Kasuge on the high would be done for if anything happened to you. What the hell? Aren't you guys Yasuo's cronies? I thought you couldn't stand the sight of me. I know, that's a lot of nice cleaning going on. Agre agreed, agreed. Chat's really good. That's terrible misunderstanding. To tell the truth, we don't know how to handle the, present the president's megalomania. If you seize this opportunity to put him in this place, the student council, the whole school really will be much better off for it. He's afraid of you. He's hiding somewhere in the school. Please find him and end his reign of terror. All right, all right. So any ideas on just where he might be hiding? He was supposed to be in the student council room. This week's objective. Each member, five masks a day. What is this? It seems like the president's supporters and detractors have extremely different opinions. What's going on here? Is one side lying? Of course. I admire our president. I, I mean, he's the one who got our school back on its feet after it was looked down on for so long. Well... It's never as simple as go to student council room, huh? Something not right. Why are these guys sucking up to me all of a sudden? Did even the student council hate Yasuo? Yeah, unfortunately, uh, I don't know why my chat box is like broke. Actually, everything broke. 
I had to restart my stream three different times for internet issues. The third time I restarted it, everything just broke my alerts and chat box. We'll have it for next stream, but yeah. Sorry about that. Twitch is also... a uh, Twitch is having problems? Twitch always has problems. The VODs. Oh yeah, someone mentioned the VODs being gone earlier. They'll come back, it's just temporary thing, Twitch fucking up. You know, same as always. I mean, I would just ask it in the chat. I, I mean, I'll try to catch it. Right now, I'm, I'm trying to find the plot, so now's a good time. Yeah, I know. Twitch is pretty terrible. I want to figure out um, what kind of things I want to do. Because I want to do, a, a, like, a YouTube streaming at least once a month. I just have to figure out what that is going to be. I could try the roof. Plugin that makes it more akin to Twitch chat. Oh, yeah, uh, Ludwig did the same thing. I know Ludwig did that. I think he was actually the one that made somebody design him. Yeah, he got somebody, like, actually to make it for him. <laughs> I might be able to figure that out, but yeah. Because I pay very much, very close attention to Ludwig. YouTube doesn't alert you for a new video! You don't have the bell rung! I like today's video, by the way. You guys should go watch it. I, I really liked it. It's uh, behind the scenes of my, uh, the, the, the... Oh my god, I can't talk. Behind the scenes of my dancing video that I did. I vlogged the process. Oh, I should go to the masquerade. That should be open. Maybe. That's a good place to go. Got a couple of vlogs coming out soon.
I still want to keep doing more videos than just the gaming highlights. So got a, I got a lot of stuff like coming. It probably won't be that popular, but it's okay. Doesn't mean I'm not going to do it. Can I go yet? Aw, oh, damn it! Alright, school nurse says, let me take a look. Should I say yes? I guess I should, just to see what she does. Oh. That was free? Free? Free healing? What in the fuck? Usually you don't trust somebody. Like, when a stranger offers you candy, you don't take it. I just had a nurse just give me free healing and I'm just like confused as to why it wasn't a scam. Did you like pickpocket me? Did I lose items or something? Why did this shouldn't have happened? That this is fake news. Of course it's the basement. Hey, could that president guy be in here? Please, let me go. I was wrong. I'll never do it again. Just forgive me. Forgive you? Forget that. There's a whole laundry list of stuff we want. We gotta ask you. There's no way we're just letting you go. You're gonna tell us about the emblem curse whether you like it or not. Whoa. Hold on, you two. Oh, Jesus. Why do they rush in without thinking? Better go after them. Come on, let's go. Yasuo, where are you? Come out! How? You'll pay for that! Hold on, Akichi-kun. Don't move until I turn on my light. Um, huh. I was sure I had a flashlight. Crazy! Now I can see! You know, Tatsuya-kun, I think next time you should have something useful like that. You should take it out a little bit sooner. Tatsuya Giga-chad. You fell for it! A walkie-talkie? What a dirty trick. Rumor has it that no one knows where the exit to that air shel ra raid shelter is. Once you're in, you'll never get out. You tricked us, you bastard! What the hell's your scheme? I'm making this school an ideal educational facility worthy of a genius like myself. But first, the vermin must be exterminated. What did you just say? Sugimoto-kun was only a stalking horse. I set the stage by spreading a rumor that the leader was stronger than the boss. I hadn't considered that you'd use it to your advantage. Hence, my plan to play the vermin against each other misfired. Come out and face us! I think not. Savage elements must be isolated lest they contaminate the rest of society. But if the ladies give me a write-up in their periodical and Lisa-san becomes my girlfriend, I'll make an exception for the females. <laughs> Sorry, our next special report's already been decided. Boss versus President, the true champion of Cuss High. Dang, girl! Maya! Plus, photographing a walkie-talkie won't be much use, even for the ad pages. Helene, How sad! That means that the only place I could take you on a date would be a customer service center. Fine, starve to death in there for all I care! 
Well, good thing I hoarded all my items since the beginning of the game. So we have a lot of materials to last us a long time. See, hoarding in RPGs is good, kids. Items, you need those at the, pre at the precise moment. And I now need my items to survive in this situation. Makes perfect sense. Ikichi, what the hell? Yeah, what she said, you moron. What you? Why'd you go and break our only contact with the outside? What? But, but. Oh well, no use crying over it now. Maya, hello. I'm so scared of this girl. It's at times like these that this that you gotta remember to think positive, guys. Together we can find a way out. Hey, isn't that the way we came in? I can't really tell. There was a rumor that someone did get out of here alive, but there God, I'm sorry. It's my fault that we're stuck in here. Don't worry. We got in here and we can get out. I'd hate to get lost, so I'm gonna leave a mark here. Oh my god, she's so smart. Waifu, waifu, waifu. <laughs> Cortez, thank you so much for the Prime Gaming. I appreciate it. I hope you enjoy the emotes. Uh, that's the way we came in, or is it? Oh. I wasn't looking at the floor. My bad. this game. Stat increased, hell yeah. Dude, all that XP though, let's go. Is there something? Okay, sorry I'm stupid. I just wanted to get across. It's only four SP to use media? Jesus Christ. Bring it on. Excuse me, are you trying to put logic in a JRPG? Yeah, you should just stop that. I level fast down here, let's go. It's a bomb shelter, it makes sense. But again, it is a JRPG. Oh, 
Oh, somebody died. How did you die? Wait, they both have Dia and Media? Oh my god, I have two fucking healers? That's amazing. We're going to drink this? A fan on to nothing doing. What? The compass is off. My sense of direction feels out of whack too. If we don't have any light, we'd be lost for sure. Look, water's trickling out here. At least we won't die or die of thirst. There's a door, but there's no way it's the exit. The rumor is that no one knows where the exit is. Great, the camera in this game is ass, and you mean to tell me my compass is gone now, so I don't know which way is fucking north? Oh my god, if this game's camera wasn't already a huge problem. Oh, no, it, okay, I have my compass. This is north, okay, we're fine. If I lost that, holy... I would truly be gone. I like that chat shares the same brain cell, and then I also share that same brain cell. Like, I'm not funny either. I know what y'all are here to watch, okay? I, I am the reactor and the crystal theorizer. That is what I do. Oh, I just poisoned everybody. Oh, fucking hell. Well, time to die. I've already checked here? What do you- what? Oh, they have chef hats! They're so cute! Oh god, are we dead? Wait a second. Wait a second. Oh. Escape. Run. Holy moly. Oh, cool, a dead end. We actually want that. Is that thing holding a gun? It's like a, it's like a little dog with a, with like one of those cute pajama hats and a gun. I am actually an idiot. Surfshark 
upped their uh, rewards for the holiday. Oh, fucking. For the holiday season. So instead of 83% off, um, the Surfshark is now 85% off. That literally makes it, I think, less than a dollar per month to have a VPN. So, like, now is the best time to get the Surfshark coupon code. Like, uh, to support the stream if you don't use a VPN. Now's the best time, because you, you get a higher deal than ever. 85% off and three months free. Like, holy shit. This is the first room we were in. Look, you can see my mark on the wall. If we ended up back at the start, we just need to figure out where we took a wrong turn. Back on the road again. Oh god, oh god, I am very not smart. With the surf shark deal, I believe it tells you if you click on the link. So if you, like, get the VPN deal, you get a two-year subscription. You can get... I think, yeah, I think it's a two-year subscription, which is only two fifty per month. Well, that's Canadian. So it's, like, a little over a dollar. And then you have two years of VPN. Like, honestly, it's a really fucking good deal. But yeah, everybody should be using a VPN on the internet, please do. Oh good, someone died. I need to, like, make my own door. Oh god! I forgot to heal! Oh fucking hell. This looks like a landslide. your favorite game oh dang well i'm enjoying persona 2 so far it's really fun don't be such a lightweight relax you can tell by the bugs in it that this water is perfectly drinkable oh god everyone's going crazy Now there's an exit somewhere. We're gonna find it. What Maya said, think positive.
A human talking with me. Hi, Gaffian. Are video games fun? They are amazing. That's not fair. What? I'm going to give you the death stare. I said a death stare, not a seductive gaze, Tatsia. Holy shit, that is not what I thought you were going to do at all. A, 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 oh, okay, like, am I wrong? Like, a death stare is supposed to be a death stare, not a seductive gaze. Katia is so weird. and I love being a motorcycle. Fucking weirdo. poisoned anymore. Oh, oops. As soon as I said that, man. good at this video game. Look at them, like, be good and shit. Okay, so we don't want to go back there. Somebody kill a, uh, Yukino. Oh no, what am I going to do with these stat points I have? I don't know. Oh, 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 God, oh, God. Leveling up should take rid of your, uh, should get rid of your status effects, too. Maya-san, you really need to stop smiling when you're boiling over with rage. Back to square one? I think we're just going in circles. Not bad, but I'm not giving up that easily. 
We'll get out of here if it's the last thing we do. This is so aggravating. If we get out of here, that guy's ass is grass. Oh, I can't die here. What would my millions of adoring fans think? This is, uh... Quite the... Oh, God! Good old dummy done it right now. Oh my god. Explosion! Thank you so much for the tier one stuff. I appreciate it. Wait, if I keep healing that thing. Oh, we're never gonna actually die. Yep, I need to change it. Instantly kill one enemy? What? This is a disaster, guys. Everybody has poison because I don't know how to walk. Yep, Balzac. It's been in a lot of games. Here, one rumor that no one knows where the exit is, and one about someone escaping with a mirror. We might have underestimated that Yasuo guy. The bedrock's thick enough that we can't dig our way out with personas. There was a rumor that someone with a mirror got out, but if there's no exit, we're screwed. Isn't this the mirror? The water's reflection? Apparently, that's not good enough to be a mirror. We're dead. It's okay. Alright, we got somebody dead. One person dead. One person. Ginko. Lisa. Oh my god, I'm not calling her Ginko. This fucking game, dude. I, I'm not calling her that. has to die, right? Okay, Maya died. I 
should be just doing media. Oh my god, what am I doing? It's the same cost of, M of SP. the not using items to heal just wait for death it works every time okay i am not smart i bet if i look at another angle maybe that would help so maybe i'm missing a mirror because i only have my camera ever facing forward Oh, I got an Agilo card. Nice. <clears throat> I love that I'm getting so many levels from this, though. So easy. All right, let me look in my inventory, too. Oh. I'm so tired. There's no exit to this place. Hey, Lisa, do you have a mirror? Ikichiko mentioned a rumor that the one person who got out used a mirror, right? I, I don't have one with me now. I usually keep it in my book bag. My, my. Hey, hey, three ladies here and none of them has a mirror. Oh, good thing I'm so beautiful. Hey, Kichi. Dude, why didn't you pull that out before if you had it? Mooning over your own face isn't helping here. I overslept and missed the stream again, Chris, to cry. Don't worry, stream isn't going anywhere. Thank you so much, Blank Rewind, for the 11 months. Appreciate it. He broke it. What now? You better take responsibility for this jackass. Me, this is your fault. You better pay me back for it. That'll be one million yen. That's enough. Thanks to you two, we just lost what might be our only hope of getting out of here. Oh, we're done for. Think positive, guys. This isn't over until we decide it is. Let's brainstorm. There has to be a way. Maya son, we're all exhausted. Let's rest a while to cool down a bit. We'll take turns keeping watch. Don't worry, guys, we might be dying, but we're gonna be fine just being positive. Tatsuya kun, it's not quite my turn yet, but do you wanna take over now? I couldn't sleep for some reason. Mind mind if I sit here? really think we can get out of here? Oh, sorry, sorry. Kind of thing positive. Oh, Mr. Bun Bun. Oh, that's so cute. If I start to complain, Mr. Bun Bun will laugh at me. Uh-oh, here he comes. Bouncy, bounce, bounce. That's the first time I've seen you smile. You've got a great one. Oh god, Tatsuya actually blushing. This guy's my good luck charm. When times are hard, like now, I always ask him what to do. So many terrible things have happened. Rumors are becoming reality, and we're under attack from actual demons. But it hasn't been all bad. I got to meet you and your friends. I'm having so much fun with you all. It's like being a kid again. bring myself to believe that Joker really is a bad guy. It was like he was a child crying after having a nightmare. It's like how you guys get into fights and try to act cool, but my persona tells me you're a bunch of good kids. I sense it the same way. 
Is that your good luck charm, Tatsuya-kun? What's this in English here? What's most important can't be seen with one's eyes. True indeed. Sometimes I wish it would be. I wish if what we think of as a real could just be all a dream. That's why I'm watching a dream go by go by while forgetting something important to me. Joker too, maybe. Sorry, didn't mean to get into such heavy stuff with you. Well, leave the look out to me and get some rest. Good night, Tatsuya kun. Sweet dreams. Aww. She's so cute. Hey, Tatsuya, do you think we're alike? Yeah, I, I don't mind either. Oh, yeah. This is my treasure. Papa gave it to me. You can have it, Tatsuya. It's okay. I mean, you're practically me, and I'm you. It'll be like I still have it. Isn't this your treasure? I thought your dad gave this to you. You can't. Okay, I understand. It'll be my treasure now. You're the greatest, Tatsuya. No matter what happens, we're gonna keep our promise to each other forever and ever. See ya, Barkeep. I'll come again. Yeah, I promise. You kids shouldn't be out so late. You'll never grow up to be upstanding citizens like that, you know? Alright, looking good there, Kaoru, and not all drunk. I'm not at all drunk. Looking like a man who's living up to his dreams. Hey, I'm gonna head home now, so you guys should go home, too. Or else I'll have to arrest you! <laughs> I literally have to speed this up. Hey, Tatsia, did you see? Grown-ups drink to forget their dreams. I don't want to grow up to be like that. Tati is so cute when he's asleep. Aww. Looks like everyone's feeling much better. Should we start thinking seriously about how to get out of here? We've all been too focused on the idea that there's no exit. You know what they say, what's most important can't be seen with one's eyes, right, Tatsuya-kun? What's going on with them? Uh-oh, Lisa's like competition! They're probably a, there's probably a loophole we're overlooking. The key to cracking this rumor's logic is the mirror. Now let's sort through what we know one more time and think of a way out. The rumor was that once you're in this air raid shelter, you can't get out, right? But why is that? You don't know. Correct! The reason we can't get out is because the rumor says no one knows where the exit is. Okay, next question. Has anyone escaped from this shelter? There was one person. That's right. There, the rumor says no one knows where the exit is. 
there was supposedly one person who did escape. And how did the person in the rumor escape? They used a certain something. What was it? Correct. No one knows where the exit is, so you can't get out, but rumor has it that one person got out using a mirror. Now, here's our problem. Since we don't have a mirror anymore, what do mirrors really do? They reflect things, right? That's it! You're not the only thing that appears in a mirror. Think about when you drive a car or ride a bike. What do you mean by everything in range? Keep going... You can look up skirts, oh my god. I feel like I have to say it, I'm, I'm saying it. The pervs they stick me with, I swear. Well, that's been our show for tonight. You've been a great audience. I mean, no, oh, you're good. I feel right for it, try and think back. What do you mean by everything in range? Keep going. Oh my god. That's the importance of a mirror. I think whoever escaped in the rumor managed it by accident, but they did it by finding an exit reflected in the mirror. Not knowing isn't the same thing as not existing. That was just as dust jumping to conclusions. I had my suspicions that would be the case right from the... With no mirror, there's no way for us to indirectly look for it. If we can't see it, we still can't get out. Not so. Is it time for me to bust this out? Ding, ding, ding. If you use your digital camera, you can take pictures of the exit and look right at it, right? Oh, my God. This fucking game, man. <laughs> that, that is a bruh moment. I fucking, okay. Us, one, rumor, zero. Come on, there's no reason to stick around anymore. Let's get out of here. I liked my explanation. I said, if you look at the puddle of water, it acts as a mirror and you can use its reflection. That made more sense than that bullshit. All right, on that note, that's a good place to stop. So we're gonna do that whole stopping thing. Oh boy. All right, I'm gonna go eat. I'm also um, kind of excited because I'm actually going to see Uncle Roger tonight. You guys know Uncle Roger on YouTubes? I'm going to a show tonight. I've never done this. I just saw he was coming into town and I was like, oh shit. I'm going to that shit, so I got tickets. <laughs> so I'm going to see Uncle Roger. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. I will see you guys on Monday with more Persona 2. So the schedule next week is going to be Monday, Wednesday, Friday, Persona 2. And Yunarakami will be back playing P5R on Tuesday and Thursday next week. 